Donkey. Donkey. Right. Hello. 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 We're on time for once. Yes, I know, I know, I know, I know. For once we're on time. For once. What can we put on? What the hell is this? You should play Tarkov on stream, it would be funny. Thank you, Corey, for the 10. Hell no! Not happening. Right, I want to play this. Um, I want to play this. I, I, Dude, I played Tarkov before. It was one of the worst experiences imaginable. I was like... I, I think every time I play that game, you get domed from someone you don't see. I can't imagine a more unfun game. Like, I get the kind of thrill... You know, kind of like Dark Souls, right? Because it's like, oh my god, if I lose, I'm going to lose like 20 minutes of progress. So I need to, you know, I need to beat this boss. And then you feel really good afterwards, right? You get that feeling in your balls and stuff. But then, Tarkov is just, you get domed from someone who's been, some, some guy on Twitch with three viewers who's been camped there the entire time. Slop. Slop moment. Oh, hey, Wendigoon, what's up? Holy shit. Peter, I gotta time you out, bro. You're sp like, like, Peter, you're the first guy I've had to time out and not for a bit. Like, actually, not for a bit. Um. Yeah, Wendigoon, I need to watch your podcast you got with uh, Meat Canyon. I need to watch that. Right, we got the funny mic out. Uh, funny mic usually means could be a main channel video. Could be. So, I I saw this game, uh, Home Safety Hotline. I was a little bit confused because I saw, like, all the mine. I, I, I saw a Markiplier, Milkiplier, and a bunch of other YouTubers play it, like, six months ago. So, I thought there was, like... Uh, I thought it was like an old game, but apparently it was a demo, and now it's just came out as like a full game. You wouldn't get it regarding Tarkov. Nah, like, like I, I get it kind of. I get it kind of. Like, I was being carried by a sweat once, and it's kind of funny. But, thing is, I, I, I was like a moron when I bought that game, right? I bought the most expensive pack that gets you like the, uh, the gamma case and stuff, so you can stick like essentials in there, so you don't lose it. I mean, I enjoyed Tarkov, but I don't know. I, I installed the single-player mod for it as well, but then I got bored. The single-player mod for the game. That was kind of cool. I think, like, the problem is, if you're, like... If you're a paranoid person, you will not enjoy Tarkov. I remember every time I would hear footsteps, I would always think that they were, like, someone else's footsteps. I was about to get one-tapped. I think what ruined Tarkov for me as well is the is the cheaters, because I'm not sure how true it was, but apparently like one in three people on that game used cheats. And in a game like COD, if someone's cheating, okay, it sucks. You had like a shit game, but like if you're killed by like a cheater in Tarkov, right, you then lose like eight, maybe eight hours of progression if you're fully decked out. Like I know, true. Thank you for the ten. I know you can. Uh, I know you can insure stuff, but isn't the insuring void? If someone yoinks your stuff anyway, that's only if someone doesn't yoink it. And then obviously if you got like really good gear, someone's going to yoink that. Who's Lila? Ah, oh, yeah, I do have that game installed. I do have that game installed. I might try that. I do, I do want to try this though. I want to try Home Safety Hotline. I want to see. It could be main channel video worthy. I'm not sure. I saw uh, that. That's the point of Tarkov. What the point of Tarkov is to pay money to be killed by cheaters and lose all your money. 
Well, that's an awful game then. Um, I was thinking of like. Stop playing Tarkov because it's like a second job. Yeah. Pyro feet cam when? Booba booba booba. I've already done it for a thousand dollars. Thank you, Mum's Minge, for the ten. I hate the fact you can put custom names in. I need to turn that off. Because some of the names you guys have are disgusting. Right, let's, uh... Talk off without cheaters would be amazing. Yep. It definitely would be. It definitely would be. I, I'd, I'd go back into Tarkov if that was the case. I just remember there were ammo types as well. And... Can you show off your good Steam games real quick? My good Steam games. Uh, I don't really have like many Steam games. Oh yeah, I installed this by the way, Alex Jones NWO Wars. I kind of want to play it on stream because it it actually looks like a well put together game. It it looks so good. Thank you, Jojo, for joining. Uh, I tried Gmod as well because you know on Gmod they have this. Uh... <laughs> In Gmod, they released a, a map that's like a one-to-one -one scale of the universe. But I can't get it to run. Look, I'll, I'll load it up for you guys before I play this game. But it literally won't... It won't run. Like, like I've got a really good PC as well. I must be doing something wrong. But yeah, hang on. Let, let, me, let me find this. Yeah, there it is. So this is Infinite Map Multiverse. This is apparently meant to be like the entire multiverse. Literally just in Gary's Mod. And every time I'm in it, it crashes after like 10 seconds. How do you stay motivated to make your long form videos? See, it's, it's gonna crash. It's gonna crash. on a game I really enjoy, but it's hard scripting and recording everything myself. Yep, there you go. It takes ages. Much love, man. Love your work. It crashes after every single... Like, it's always after like a specific amount of time. Space? I saw some people running around in it. Doesn't it need 64 gig of RAM? I think like 32, but I've got 64. Oiled up TF2 stream win. You need 64-bit version of... Your PC is just crappy. I'll show my specs, little bro. Throw the PS5 again. I'll show, I'll, show my, I'll show my specs on stream. The specs are good. Uh... How do you stay motivated? Um, well, yeah, it's, it's, it's like I've always been saying that the second channel content, I don't care about. It's just slop. If I just had to do that all the time, I would probably quit YouTube. But the, the main channel stuff is like passion project, and I'm just happy that that is actually sustainable for like income and stuff. Oiled up TF2 stream when? <laughs> I got I got mods on TF2, man. I can't be I can't be doing that again on accident. You should throw the PS5 again. No, I can't I can't mill house the bit. I need to space it out. I can't keep showing. I can't keep throwing it against the wall. Right, I show my specs. Space Bing defeats overpriced PC. Roly Poly's no Nana Karobi Yoki is waiting, King. Please give me a reason to draw your Sona and the Cho Fox, please, man. Look, my, my specs are good. 64 gig of RAM, Intel i9, uh, 4090, and then I got an 8 terabyte, and then I got two 2 terabytes. They're, they're good specs. Everyone's saying mid. Wait, you say leafy pose? I was resting my fucking hand on my chin. Shut up. Right, I want to play this now. Give me a reason to draw your sona. Uh, do it. You mentioned in your Half-Life 3 video that you might do a main channel video on fear. Do you still plan on making it in the future? Just wondering cause I'm a huge fan of the first fear. Also, what's the current list for main channel vids? 
Current list for main channel videos. I haven't really thought about it too far. The next video is going to be um, Shotgun Roulette and all the games that Mike made. And then after that, it's going to be Darkwood. And then after that, I'm not really sure. Because the Lethal Company video was a little bit of like a slop video. And the Shotgun Roulette video is also going to be a bit of a slop video. But I still want to keep the consistency. I don't, I don't want to keep just following like new release games. So Darkwood is an old one. Uh, it's funny, actually, I've seen, like, in the past month, like, four video essays pop up on Darkwood from channels that have, like, 2,000 subs, and they get, like, that amount of views per video, but as soon as they do a video on Darkwood, they get, like, hundreds of thousands of views. When are the waifu cups shipping? I need my fat furry juice. The waifu cups, uh, I don't know if they've shipped yet or not. When will I play Terraria? I will never play Terraria on stream, it's boring. Right, I want to play this now. Uh, Home Safety Hotline. I hope this is one of those games that gets into your PC, man. I'm really, I'm really sick of that. This is another PS1 graphics game. Thank you, Norman, for joining. Logging in user guest monitor complete. NSC Discord. Delete. Wait, why did I delete the save? I just started the game. <laughs> Why did I delete the save? I just started the game. Log out. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm actually dumb. Check out and play Thank you, Joseph Sneedley, for the 50. Pseudo Garia? Hang on, let me look now. I'd usually just say yeah and then never check it out, but you gave me 50, so... Yeah, let's have a look. Pseudo... What is this? Oh damn, it's like overwhelmingly positive. Damn, that's cr- Yeah, that's overwhelmingly positive. Oh, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. It's because it's a fairy game. Yep, it's because it's a fairy game. Yep. I, I was wondering why are the reviews so good on something so niche. It's a fairy game. It's a fairy game. How does it run? Okay, this is like fairy Dark Souls then, right? So basically normal Dark Souls. All running, Titan 4 reference. Uh, I must do a video essay on how good Titanfall 2 is! Uh. It looks good. Definitely PS1 inspired. PSX. It's goated? God, I have a lot of fairies in my chat. Jesus Christ. What, why are you... I don't know why there's so many fairies here. It doesn't make any sense. Right, hang on. I'm gonna buy that on Steam real quick. So I don't forget. I'm just, I'm not showing my card on screen. There's like five quid, that's not too bad. There's some videos I wanted to watch as well, but I do want to play this game first. I have no idea how long it's going to be. Hang on, I'm buying it. And then we'll do uh, this safety hotline. Right, that's done. Penis. Among Us penis. Um... Oh, one of the mods told me that the Pyro Cups said on the website. Yeah, cheers to that, Doc. Uh, if anyone's asking about the Pyro Cups, they're going to start shipping out in March. Jeez, that's a while. You guys got scammed. 
<laughs> what terrible company. Come on, Schlatt, do better. Okay. I'm gonna say, this game sucks. Because I can't, like, you know when you, you know when, when, you, when you were in class at school, right? And you would, like, draw boxes, like rectangles and stuff. You can't do that. How do you find most of these games? Uh, I actually get chat tell me about them. Like, chat actually tells me about them most of the time. It, it, it's funny, because I, it's like when I see Critical Stream, it's like an infinite content mill, because it's like, ah, oh, I don't have anything to talk about. <laughs> and, then, and then you start streaming, and then chat basically just feeds you. Uh, credits? Oh yeah, probably best to not go through them, actually, because that might give spoilers. Uh, let's do options. Resolution. I'm assuming I can't make it widescreen. Oh, I can. 2560, 144. Ooh, max. <coughs> Full screen. Hey, Byro. Been watching since 2019. Do I have permission to paint you? Also, have you played Dead Cells? Uh. Thank you, Tim, for the tent. Yeah, I don't mind with art. Go for it. Damn, your double chin looks like the flaps of the godskin noble. Alright, Jamie, I'm going to time you out if I see you in chat again. I'm going to time you out for real. Do we do CRT filter or no? I feel CRT filter is kind of cool. I don't think it matters. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Do it for the vine. Uh... No, 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 I, no, 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 I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that, I, I, I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to start the game, 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 I didn't mean to, 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 no, I wanna, I wanna see everything before I start the game, alright, delete my save again, You should play Lunacid. I have, it's a good game. Right, okay, uh, let's do television commercial. Dude, that is so cool. Look at that, you can skim across and everything. That is so sick. Every year, thousands of families suffer injuries from common household hazards, such as house fires, flooding, Black mold. I mean, that's like in every UK home. Like any uni accommodation, it will be covered in black mold. It's basically what you pay for. Metamorph. Okay, I like that. I like what all analog horror does. This, by the way, it's like uh, normal thing, normal thing, normal thing. Oh, spooky. To be fair, if this was like a YouTube analog horror, the audio for the instructional video would have just cut out. Don't become a statistic. Call the home safety hotline to keep your family safe. Okay. So now we know. What's in the mailbox? Let's have a look. Oh wow, this is loading like an old ass like Macintosh or something. Welcome from HSH Corporate. Welcome to the Home Safety Hotline family. We are pleased to have you aboard as our brand new Home Safety Hotline responder. Your supervisor's... It's got a notification. Your supervisor's name is Carol Regina. She'll be in call with you today to brief you on your duties and will be reviewing your work daily to ensure maximum accuracy. As a reminder, Responders with a 90% accuracy rate or more will qualify to receive our daily employee coupons. Work hard and be rewarded with incredible savings. Sincerely, HSH Corporate. Oh my god, we get coupons, guys. Guys, we get coupons. I'm so excited. I really hope... It's, it's like when you work at McDonald's and then you waste five years of your life working for corporate overlords and they give you a little... They give you a little gold star. They give you a little gold star on the name badge. 
Attention call team, due to an error with our archival network, some of you may notice video files from our video archive appearing on your desktops. Please disregard these, they will be cleared up in due time. It almost had as many wrinkles as your ginimous chins. Love you daddy pyro pepe laugh pepe laugh. Thank you your mum's minge. Uh... Oh. Oh, that's oh. We got the default windows, boys. We got the default windows. I like that. Handyman, Luna Sky. I do like office cooler. Wait, 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 wait. Do you see these? Do you see these, chat? Do you see these? Phobia toggles. Arachnophobia. Entomophobia. Nyctophobia. Tripophobia. Skibbity toilet phobia. Fear of being watched. Oh, I don't like this. Claustrophobia. Cynophobia. Tur <laughs> Someone in chat just said turn on homophobia. <laughs> <laughs> Turn <on homophobia>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was like that was the first funny message on this stream in like three years. <laughs> uh, turn on homophobia. God, I wish that would go on in a heartbeat. I hate the gays. Uh, all right. Uh Hey Pyro. Last year you made a video about the snail game scandal with Ark. I wanted to see how much it would take for you to play Ark Ascended. All the way to at least beating the spider boss of the game. I genuinely wanna see you play it. Thank you, Shaddy, for the ten. Um, I don't know, I feel like I'd have to get some mates together for Ark. Do you remember when Vin Diesel was meant to be in that game? Fat Phobia, okay. Now 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 we're getting into unfunny territory, guys, come on. Right, let's begin. Let's begin, let's begin. I'm a little bit spooked. Uh, there was a lot of phobias listed there. There was a lot of phobias. Uh, uh. Welcome, employee, to begin. Shift, please I'm clock in below. Bob. I'm Squidward. You got Mrs. Puffa Chin. Thank you, Kurt, for the 10. I'm skipping that, bro. It was like 10 fart sounds. Spooky face! Spooky face! Uh, That's pausing. That's settings. Scary noise. I don't know where to put my uh, my face cam. Maybe here. Oh, incoming call. Hello. Welcome to Home Safety Hotline, new employee. My name is Carol, and I'll be acting as your supervisor during your time here. Hi, at Carol. HSH. Hi, Carol. Before you begin your first day here, let me tell you a bit about how things work here. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. As such, it is your job to learn about various household hazards so you can answer the questions of our callers intelligently. When a client calls, answer the call and listen carefully to their concerns. When you diagnose license, their issue, please. submit the corresponding household hazard, and we'll forward them safety instructions to address their problem. Welcome to the HSH family. I'm sure we'll talk again soon. Okay, so when someone... When someone calls me... I need to deduce what the problem is. Thank you, Joseph, again for the 50. Sludge life. I haven't heard of that one. Uh, bees, bed bugs. Okay, we got a call, we got a call. Let's hear, let's hear. John here. Hi, John. My wife insisted I call this number. 
Hi, John. It sounds like she thinks we might have some kind of infestation. My wife keeps telling me about specks of dirt or something in the kitchen. Just looks like coughing to me. I don't know. You tell me. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just an Italian, eh? Okay, my wife insisted I call this number some kind of infestation. My wife keeps telling me about specks of dirt or something in the kitchen. Please hey, hey, hold. How's the fear and hunger vid coming along, brother? I've been wanting to learn about the game's universe, but I've not seen anyone make a comprehensive video on it, so big ups to you, Garten of Bam Bam. Thank you, Cosmo, for the 10. I think there's been loads of videos on Fear and Hunger's universe. But, yeah. Right, okay, so what, what did he say again? What did he say again? John here. Actually, I don't need to hear that. It sounds like we have some kind of infestation. My wife keeps telling me about specks of dirt or something in the kitchen. That could be mold, but she said infestation. Uh, itchiness, no. Attract other pests. Okay, it's not it's not bed bugs. That's not a bed bug, by the way. That's a what do they call it? An aphid? I forget. That's not a bed bug. Bees. Okay. It probably is black mold, but he, he said infestation. Small black dots. Specks of dirt or something in the kitchen. Um... Okay, we. I, I think I think it's black mold, but I want to see if there's like any other insects that leave like you know stuff around. It just sounds like someone eating. Rustling sounds. He never said sounds. Ah, oh, it could be cockroaches, right? Because they like they poop like everywhere. Yep, droppings. Droppings that appear coffee. Yeah, 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 there you go. Who in chat said black mold? Who in chat said black mold? Get him out of here! Get him out of here! I told you, I told you it was cockroaches. He literally said coffee. Housefly. <laughs> House spider. Okay, I'm, I'm nervous now, there's spiders. Nice. I feel there's gonna be a gimmick with how these images take so long to load up that it's gonna be like a jump scare. There's so many entries. There's so many. You got mole. Raccoon. Oh, look at that little fella. You got termites. Uh, you got ticks. Ticks are horrible. Right, okay, let's uh, let, let's submit. So, do we pick it from here and then press submit? Let's try that. Uh, bed bugs, black molds, cockroaches. So you get as much time as you want. Info sent. Good job. So when am I told if it's like accurate or not? I don't like you're just waiting for another call. Oh. Hi, I'm so sorry. My name is Grace and it's probably nothing, but I thought I could just in case. Lately, I can't sleep at night because of this annoying little sound coming from my attic. Uh, it sounds kind of like you know, e e e it's probably nothing. I'm sure it could just be regular old house noises, but I just thought I'd call to ask and make it, sure. It, so it sounds like e e e e. Hey, Byro, e keep up the good slop. Please. I rewatch bods occasionally when playing games. As I think that's you. mice, right? Is that mice? Oh, we got gopher. That's a new one. Oh, it might be gopher. Uh oh, this one. This one's a bit of a hard one. 
Thank you, Pally, for the 10. Yeah, we're actually trying to, uh... We're trying to get the VODs channel backed up now. Your mic isn't on. Unlucky. It's in the attic, though. Yeah, yeah, and Gopers... Didn't it say Gopers are found underneath households? Living in boroughs. Borough on their property. Yeah. So it's, it's gotta be a it's gotta be a mouse, right? Cause she said the attic as well. I'm getting my first PC this week and hope to make my own content. Any advice for starting out? Uh be a Valorant be a Valorant streamer. Be a Valorant streamer, so hopefully you can get to Pokemon's uh friend circle. I think it's mice. So we just submit mice. Where's mice? The muted bit is so unfunny, guys. Come on. It's at the same three people as well. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Incoming call. Hello. This one'll be like my family's dead. They were all murdered. Hank here. Last week I called your guys about some crap in my yard. I was told it wasn't anything to worry about. Well, guess what? There's more piles of crap in my yard. Oh my God! Damn! 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 Crap! Damn! Damn! Crap! Damn! 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 Tell me what it is, so I can take care of it once and for all. If you call for the eight months. They, they took her jibs. They took her jibs. Please hold. Crap in my yard. Well, guess what? There's more piles of crap in my yard. Huge piles of brown. Okay, that's going to be gophers or moles. <laughs> uh, I need to find out which one it is. It could, it could be, uh... It could be moles or it could be gophers. They both live in boroughs though. Yeah, I don't know. He said in his yard. I'm actually not sure. It's gophers or moles. But there's no real difference. Moles, uh... Deep burrows. I don't know. Moles, because gophers don't have piles of dirt. Yeah, I, I, I guess we submit mole. Check raccoon, they don't live in... Nah. He said piles of brown. So it's not, it's, it's, it's gotta be a mole, right? I'm too quiet. Oh wait, Wendigoon raise? Did he just wrap up streaming? Did we actually get raided? By the Guna, the Guna himself? 
If so, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, I need to find out how to actually uh, host people on YouTube. I don't understand how it works. Uh, I remember it was so easy to do on Twitch, but it's so... Read the mole's danger. They're capable of biting humans and spreading deadly diseases such as rabies. They also have close relations to the ones beneath the soil. Uh-oh. What, what, what are the ones beneath the soil? Okay, I'm gonna pick this one. Because I feel if I pick Gopher, I'm gonna get this guy killed. Let's pick Mole. Hopefully that was right. Hopefully that was right. Imagine you play it one time, the audio, and it just goes... Chaos reigns. Jacksepticeye raid. Oh, okay. No, now you're doing a bit. Now you're doing a bit. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. We're already the analog horror. Already. L let distorted face. Ah, I'm going insane. Better head on over and catch us, big fella. Twig Sigmund here. Just call in to inform you that your refrigerator has been running wild for the past 45 to 90 minutes. Better, better head over and catch it. What does that mean? What does that mean? You is is this where I get up in the game? IRL. Hey, do you guys have a lawn mowing service or something? My good for nothing kid refuses to mow and it's getting real crazy out there. Looking like a rainforest over here. My kid is complaining about being too sick to do anything about it. Meh, 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 meh. That's not What? That's not an infestation. Do you guys have a lawn mowing service? My kid wants my kid is too lazy to mow the lawn. There's no infestation. Please hold. What do I pick? What do, what do I pick? Is it is that a troll? There's nothing new that's become available. Oh, my kid's too sick. It might actually be bed bugs, right? What about ticks? There was ticks there, right? They can make you really ill, ticks. I think it's Lyme disease. Oh yeah, there you go. Okay, yeah, let's do ticks. Let's do ticks, sure. Let's do ticks. Oh yeah, found in tall grass. I see. Oh, accuracy 100%. Let's go. Let's go. That's good. 100% accuracy. Nice. GG's, chat. Human DNA confirmed. Okay, that was hilarious. Let me open my mail. 
files on desktop. Uh, quit before it's too less lasat. You don't know me, but I used to have your job. You are near. Whoa, danger! Quit today before it's too late. You don't know enough. It's not too late to quit freely. Trust me. Ooh, I got a I got a coupon. Congratulations, employee. Your high accuracy rate has awarded you today's daily coupon. This is the bug spray. It helps keep those bugs where they belong outside. Just one spray keeps insects at bay. Using state-of-the-art chemical makeup, insects are repelled by the pet safe scent and will immediately seek the fresh air of outdoors faster than you can shake a fly swatter at. To receive your discount, simply type in the following code during checkout. Buzz off. There it is, the bug spray. That that email's a little bit scary. Most most literate pirate viewer right there. Most literate pirate viewer. Alright, I guess we do another one. We do another one. I like s someone in chat said true to what I just said and they misspelled true. <sighs> to begin shift, please clock in below. Here you go, Pyro Cynical from Pyro Live. I give you money I originally intended for the ninth Gotrek and Felix novel because you deserve it. Thank you, Skungus, for the 10. Appreciate it. Right, we got no new entries. Yeah, nothing's new. I guess we, we wait for a call. What we got? Hello, it's Carol again, your supervisor. Hi, Carol, hi! You've been granted access to additional household hazard information. Please be aware that this information is confidential and not to be shared with anyone outside of HSH. If you diagnose one of these hazards, we will be providing only information to the clients that is pertinent to addressing their concerns. Nothing more. Thank you. I got a feeling these are going to be some spooky ones now. These, yeah, these, these are going to be some spooky ones. A bat? Bad teeth. Okay. <laughs> uh, calling to see if you might know about anything I can do to... <laughs> Sorry. Uh, anything you can do to uh, prevent pollen from coming in the house? I think there's something seriously wrong with my ventilation or something, because I cannot stop sneezing. Uh, in the past, I haven't had problems so long as I've stayed inside, but I think something is getting in. Please hold. Mike Schmidt. What is bad teeth? Is that chat? Is that is that a real thing? Is bad teeth like a real thing? What the hell are bad teeth? That's not real, right? Uh, carbon monoxide. That would not be what he's got, because that would just kill him straight up. Yeah, it's, it's not carbon monoxide, that would... There's no audio, what? There's, au there's an audio sample for smoke, what? Right, that's helpful. Carbon monoxide can cause death in humans and pets. Yeah, carbon monoxide kills you, like, so quickly. Cellular growths, uh-oh. Uh-oh. There's an audio sample. That is terrifying. A slimy residue, the sound of dripping or stretching. Uh, their weight can often cause duress to a home's foundation. Sad men farting. 
fire vulnerable. I have serious afraid. Tommy P. Drake. That was that was one of the worst donors ever. You you, you really tried to get your ten dollars worth there, buddy. You used like seven different voice samples. What's well, common hop? Is that is that a midget? Common hop's the most common species of hob. I I thought it meant like like. like like a hub on a stove. That's what I thought it meant. They are small humanoid creatures with grey burlap skin and small tufts of hair on their head. They have no false face. They are known for their tendency to consume dust, dirt, and sticky substances found on floors. Whoa! Okay. Okay. Sticky. They 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 lick the sticky stuff off the floor. Okay. Okay. Let him cook now. They genuinely. Generally, only come out at night. They're not dangerous to humans on their own. If provoked, they are capable of mischievous acts and metamorphoses. Okay, we, I remember. I remember in the intro video, metamorphoses is like really bad. That's like that's a really bad thing. Hobs cannot be compelled to leave on their own. Instead, one should take measures to prevent metamorphoses by leaving out a bowl of cream or milk. What's a desk hob? They regular like they regularly like to tidy their homes and will sort materials. They're physically similar to hobs, but are much smaller and have raspy, loose hair. They do not bear a false face. I have no false face. False beat. Am I actually quiet? Am I quiet or are you doing a bit? Do I do I need to turn my mic up or not? I, I I can't tell if you're doing a bit or not because it, it, like like the mic is literally maxed out. It's a bit, yeah. I I thought it was a bit. A false beat. Yeah, what is that? They're creatures with beet-like appearance that have been known to trick gardeners into harvesting and eating them, disguising themselves among vegetables. False beets are harmless unless eaten by a human, at which point they will take root in the human's stomach, feeding off its nutrients for its lifetime. Hey Byron, I hope it was bad teeth, not bad teeth, and oh Mike is fine. Thank you, Chris, the 10. They can cause back problems. I'm looking for one that causes like a cold fracture hub. They cause cracks in furniture and walls. They inhabit physically similar to other hobs. Uh, they also bear a false face. So that's the only one with a false face. They're longer, wilder hair locks. Frozen pipes. Water inside, causing stoppages, cracks and leaks. Faucet smells, banging and whistling sounds. Why does your mic sound like it's coming through, Agba? A GBA? Well, that that's part of the experience, buddy. We're on like a 90s computer. Wait, who said the Fracture Hub looks like me? Who said that? Are you stupid? The hair is like nothing similar. The, the hair... The hair looks nothing similar. At all. His hair is going off like... Like this. His hair is like that. My, my hair doesn't go off like that. You guys will literally find any... You, you'll find anyone with a hair parting and be like, Oh, it's a parasitical. Uh -huh. <laughs> house fires. I wish your house had set on fire. Are you oi tiny for the 18 months? House fires are rapidly combusting inside a person's home. Uh, homeowners affected, report the smell of burning. How's I've already seen those. Uh, pipe growth. Oh, it's a little bit chunky.
That's not what a pipe sounds like. Okay, that's a little bit scary. There are a type of fungus that are known for making homes inside damp tube-like structures. They will therefore clog the pipe indefinitely until their removal. They make a loud bubbling digestion noise after they eat a full meal. Pipe growths are known to attempt to eat anything that comes inside their domain. Most commonly, accidents occur when a human child attempts to reach their hand inside their home. Do not attempt to reach your hand inside an active pipe growth home. They are otherwise harmless to humans. To remove a pipe growth, it must be offered a replacement. Any common PCP pipe will suffice. One should garnish the inside with an assortment of meat juices and insects. Place the replacement home near one of the pipes and leave it overnight. The pipe growth should have moved into its new home, where it could be safely relocated away from the household. Dude, I would just... Like you belong in the game prior to also you have the smile of the caller. Don't smile, please. I have the smiler of the caller. What does that mean? Thank you, Leah, for the 10. Truly for the 10. Don't do donors like that when I'm playing a horror game. Don't do that. That's not funny. Come on, chat. The Fracture Hob doesn't even look like Pyro. He has way more hair than Pyro ever did. I might turn off TTS. I'm not sure yet. I might turn off TTS. The Fracture Hob has more hair than I do. The Fracture Hub has more hair than I do. Chat, I'm sorry, but look, 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 look how much, look how much hair I have. Look how much hair, look how much hair I have on my head right now. Look how much hair I have on my head. And, and it's not that I look like the Fracture Hub, I'm now balding apparently. Yeah, that's funny. Right, what are we thinking? He's sneezing a lot. Anything to prevent pollen from coming inside the house? I think there's something wrong with my ventilation because I cannot stop sneezing. I think there's something in his ventilation making him sneeze. So it could be one of these fungi. What's bed teeth again? Mild discomfort, itching. No, uh, he's got... He's got like... They can grow sharper over time if left untreated. It's mold? Oh, it could be mold. Yeah, true. Allergic reactions or breathing problems? It could be mold. Should it be mold? Yeah, let's do mold. The <laughs> Someone said I took so long, the caller probably already died. <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry, I was reading all the lore. He just collapsed on the floor. It was bees? No, it wasn't bees. Nah, it wasn't it wasn't bees, it wasn't bees. Do you know if there's such a thing as house saves that clean? Like Ah, uh, th this will be the hops. This will be the hops. This will be the hubs. When I go look at it, I find the place spotless, but haven't yet found anything missing. Yep. I've talked with the cops, but they keep telling me to call this number. So here I am. Is there something you can do? Okay. Please hold. I, th I think that this is going to be one of the hubs. It's either going to be a common one or a desk one. She was on about uh, house thieves that clean. Consume dust, dirt. 
floors. Now, where did she say cleaning though? Because they both clean. House thieves that clean. Noise coming from my living room, but when I go to look, I find the place spotless. Uh, they're known for their tendency to consume dust, dirt, found on floors and dishes, cleaning them in the process. Subspecies of hob inhabit desks. Tidy their homes, frequently sort other materials in the desk. A desk is in the living room, right? I don't know. I don't know. There's another hob as well, I think. Fracture hob. Hi Pyro. I've been watching your content for around nine years and I wanted to thank you for the consistently good content you put out. Genuinely one of my favorite YouTubers on this platform. TTS volume is a bit low BTW. Thank you, Ref. Are you reprehensions? The 10? Appreciate it. House cracks and furniture. Uh... Okay, that's not... That's not the right one. It's a common or it's a desk, but I, d I don't know what the difference is. This looks like a living room. They have no false face. Consume dust, dirt, sticky substances, floors and dishes. Uh, that looks like a living room, so I think... Oh my god, shut the fuck up, wife neck, and show me those feet, slop boy. Kuma, I'm not showing my feet on stream. Yeah, let's do common hop. Did Trevor Henderson do designs for the game? Is that the guy on Twitter that draws all the scary stuff? Alright, hopefully it's right. I want that coupon. I want that coupon. I want that coupon. Oh, we got something else. Dare slug. Ugh. Is that the only... Stair slugs are large dog-sized slugs. That is horrible. All right, what we got now? Yo, Buzz Goober here. Been having a heck of a time over here. I got these snappers itching and whooping and crying all over. <laughs> whooping. He looks like Mr. Potato Head in real life. Also, like, I'm that termly online. I read his name as Buzz Guna. He sounds like a Don Polo edit. <laughs> oh my god, he does! He actually sounds like a Don Don Polo edit. Me know what? Oh yeah, me me now. Um. I wasn't even processing what he was saying, honestly. He was speaking in, like, five dimensions. I've been having a heck of a time. I got these snappers itching and whooping and crying. Uh... Hey, Byro. Sorry to interrupt. I had an idea for a possible game of subs flavor that, although not possible, would be interesting. What's the flavor? It possibly include some form of carbonation due to your affinity for R. Uh... Anyways, love you, Pyro. Ship. Thank you, Drifter, for the 10. Carbonated. Carbonated flavor. That's actually a really genius idea. I don't think that's possible, though. Because, like, to make something carbonated, you need to inject CO2 into it. So I don't, I don't think that would work. That That's actually really clever, though. Belch in your mouth flavor. That would be a good one. Uh, I got these snappers. I'm gonna be honest. If I had a stair slug in my house, then it owns the house at that point lol. Also if you mess up on a report, you'll get a call later on telling you about it all spooky like smile. Thank you Gabby for the 10. 
Yeah, I want to get 100% run on this. I don't want to mess up anything. I've uh, been having a heck of a time over here. These snappers itching and whooping, crying just all over the place. I've got these snappers yelping and whining. I can't get a wink of sleep. Just trying to lay down over here. What are you going to do? You've been called about 55 times and you haven't done a thing about it. Oh, that wasn't even like a test. That, yeah, that wasn't even like a test. He just hung up. What's a pipe hop? No. Please hold. It might be a stair slug. Great news, Pyro. Today the BBC reported a surprise rise in inflation rates. The news you have been waiting for. Thanks for the slot. That's such good news. A rise in inflation in the UK, finally. Thank God. Thank God. That's that's the news. That's the news I've been wanting to hear. Stair slugs can be beneficial. Uh, they feed on mice and hubs. But you can slip on their slime. Should you wish to remove one? Uh, barrier of salt. Don't apply salt directly. What could this be, chat? Here's something crawling, crawling in the walls. Teeth marks on the bedpost. Something crawling in the walls and teeth mark, teeth marks on the bedpost. Uh, termites? It can't be though. Teeth marks? No way. I mean, that's just. Thank you, King, for the 18. Mice? I don't know, this one's a hard one, actually. I think it was a growth, but because of the teeth marks, that's, like, very specific. I hear something crawling in the walls. I think I found teeth marks on my bedposts. I can't sleep at night. Here's something crawling in the walls. It could just be something normal as well, like, like, like a rat or something. The hubs clean stuff, they don't like actually damage the house. Imagine I just submit it to false beast. It's a mouse? Carpenter ants. Yeah, let's have a look at that actually. Thank you King for 18. Faint rustling sounds. The bite when threatened. Spread disease, cause damage to homes. Ah, oh, it could be carpenter ants. It could be. Uh, I could look at mice. Hang on. I, I feel it's a normal one. I feel this is a normal one to throw you off. Households. Nor marks. Nor marks. This game has vague hypnospace outlaw vibes. Which I've shilled before and will do again. I think you'd like it as there's more to it than meets the eye. Take my tendilla and humor a long time fan since the MLG age, would you kindly? Someone said Fracture Hubs. Look at Fracture Hubs. I can look at Fracture Hubs. Cracks in furniture and walls. Nah. Nah, she, she said nothing about damage to the house. She's only mentioned teeth marks. But they cause fractures, like actual, like, hairline fractures in walls and stuff. Hairline fractures. I a fucking hairline joke. Fuck's sake. Shut up. It's gotta be mice, right? It's gotta be mice.
I'll do mice. I'll do mice. Every, every, everyone's saying hairline. Everyone's saying hairline over another shot. SHUT UP! I feel that's wrong. But we'll see. I mean, teeth marks, though. There was nothing else with teeth marks. The hairline hub. Yep, there we go. Yep, get it out of your system. The hairline hub. The fucking hairline hub. Bastard. Yeah, Hello, Fred. Hey, I'm calling about a noise I've been hearing in my house lately. Sounds like scratching or something. It's real quiet. So definitely some kind of pest in my walls. I've sent out all kinds of traps, but uh, I thought one worked for a while. But then I started hearing it again this week. I thankfully haven't seen any visible damage or droppings or whatever. Okay. Okay, so that's not a mouse. A mouse has teeth marks, so he's seen no- he hears something, but he's seen nothing. Schizophrenia? <laughs> <laughs> Could it be schizophrenia? Um, scratching or something, it's been real quiet. There's something in the walls. He set traps and it worked for a while. So maybe there's something... Oh, what could that be? We got no new entries. I've been hearing scratching, but he hasn't seen anything. Carpenter ants? Nesting inside of wood? Faint rustling sound coming from their walls as the ants build their nest. They're not dangerous to humans, but they bite when threatened. They're also known to spread disease and cause damage to homes they nest within. Now, that says they cause damage to homes, so this could be a carpenter ant that they're like, that's just got into the house, like a nest. It could be... STOP SAYING HAIRLINE HUB FOR EVERY ANSWER! IT'S SO UNFUNNY! Scratching. I don't know, could it- could it be... A raccoon? Could it be a raccoon? Surely not. Will you ever make a video on Baldur's Gate 3, or stream it? Why do you look like the hob? <laughs> it's not funny. It's so unfunny. You just sing Hell on Hob over and over. Chat has one joke. Chat has one joke. Uh tube like structures. I think it could be carpenter ants. He said no droppings or anything either. But wouldn't ants leave droppings? Imagine I just submit a house fire. Yeah, I think your house is on fire, bro. <laughs> you should get out of there. <laughs> they cause cracks and fractures in the walls. Yeah, he would have seen that, though. He would have seen that if it was the- STOP LOOKING AT THE FRACTURE HOB, MAN! I'm calling about a noise I've been hearing in my house. Sounds like scratching or something. It's real quiet, but there's definitely some kind of pest in my walls. Should, should we just do the- should we do the ant? Should we do the ant? Carpenter ant? I can't think of anything else. What should we do? Should we do ant? Stop saying hairline hub. Stop saying hairline hub. 
Stop saying hairline hop. It is the most unfunny bit chat has ever made. Ever. My hairline, my hairline isn't even that bad. My hairline, my hairline isn't even that bad. Look at that. That's a normal hairline. That is a completely normal hairline. I'm not going bold. I'm not going I bold. A normal hairline. You keep saying after. hairline harp over and over. And, and, that, and now, everyone's going to chat on stream Thank saying it's the over. Spot. They're all going to start saying on stream saying it's over. Watching this while doing my dissertation. Thanks for always making great content, hairline hop. Stop saying it's over! Stop saying it's over! It's not over, it's normal hairline! Vegeta hairline! I can't, I can't, I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Stop saying it's over. How is it over? How is it over? It's a normal hairline. It's a normal hairline. There's, there, there's nothing wrong with this hairline. It's completely normal. Actual fucking children, literally just saying the same thing over and over. Viral uh. Got a forty dollar Zuba ride between your hairline and eyebrows. We all have our coping mechanisms. It's not. It's not a coping mechanism. It's not a coping mechanism. The hair, that, that, that is a normal hairline. That is normal hairline. I am not going bold. That is, that is completely normal. That's not, that's not receded at all. At all. At all. Moses parted hairline! Fucking hell! Moses parted hairline! Moses parted hairline! I gotta walk out of the room. I gotta, I gotta.
come back. Come back. I do want to say the hairline. Hair the line. hair. The hair. <laughs> I just came back, 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 and they're still doing the fucking hairline! Stop! That bit needs to die, it's so unfunny. Look at this guy, this guy waited for me to come back just so he could do the hairline bit. How many times can you say hairline? Hairline eating, hairline eating, you fat bastard! You hairline, disgusting hairline, fat hairline, bastard! Hairline, Give me ten dollars just so you hairline, can do eating hairline. greasy chips. Mr. Hairline, I am Dr. Jebediah Gold Striker, and I can officially diagnose you with male pattern baldness. <laughs> Bro, looking like he's ready to fight semi-perfect cell and throw in the last minute for a bit. Thank you, Prince, for uh, ten. Balding at 26. I'm not balding. Okay, okay, can we can we get back to the game now, please? Can we get can we get back to the game? Maybe? Maybe? Maybe chat? Maybe? Maybe? Thinking? Thinking emoji? Why is this falling back now? Why does it take so long to adjust this gay little camera? Right, okay. I didn't know how your community went from breaking bad memes to making fun of your appearance. Uh, because they are mentally ill children. They should be shot in the My back of the head in front the of their family. Your hairline is completely normal for a bald person. Bald or cynical. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find your home address. I'm going to kill you. Uh, thank you. Who gifted? Who gifted? Thank you, Bleep Bloop, for the 15 gifted. Appreciate it, man. The man who sold the thank you. Much appreciated, brother. Alright. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Right, what do we think this was? Carpenter ants, right? Let's just say carpenter ants. I'm hoping that was right. I don't want to get chewed out by uh, HR. Uh, hello? Do you guys handle security? I need home security installed. That okay, KSR's dad. I'm going into my house and going through all my stuff at night. I know it's Bob from accounting. He's always been envious of me. I know what you're doing, Bob. Going through my papers, taunting me with your organization skills. I need your best home security equipment. Pronto! Okay, this is a desk hub, without a doubt. This is a desk hub. Like, even I know what that is. I need some security. Someone's breaking into my house, going through my stuff. He's always been envious. Going through my papers, taunting me with the organization skills. No. Yeah, it's, 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 it's hub. It's, it's a desk hub. Definitely a desk hub. Yep. That one was an easy one. You're see a hundred percent. Let's go, baby. Let's go. You've reached the end of your scheduled work session. Perfect. Hairline hub. I'm timing you out. I'm timing you out. Ten, ten, ten hour timeout. Ten hour timeout. Ten hour timeout. Yep, there you go. Unlucky. Alright, what we got? We got a broadcast. We got a mailbox. Okay. Hey don't again, do the door knock! Don't like do the, the door knock! The don't idea. do the door knock when Maybe I'm playing this game! Of carbonation, it could be sort of fizzy. Still, I think the idea has some merit considering how you're a degenerate. Love you, Byro, and keep up the good slop. Thank you, Drifter. For the 10. Cheer up.
You shouldn't let these hairline comments get you down Hob cynical smile. Rodonium, thank you for the 10. I'm going to blacklist your name so you can't dono again. Yeah, what have we got? Subject the line, it's... sold the hairline, hairline hop. Okay. I'm just not going to engage anymore. It's too late for you now. They gave you access to more info, didn't they? I warned you. If you end up like me, join me in this hole. They haven't found me yet. It's safe here. Alright, we'll do matches. Attention, call team. Our network team is migrating our backend services over a new hosting provider this week. So you may experience some occasional network errors over the next few days. Please... Be sure you are studying your information entries carefully where you still have access in case the network goes down or you're on the phone with a client. You will still be expected to provide accurate answers to our callers regardless of the network status. Sincerely, HSH Corporate. McDonald's hairline, KSI forehead, Balding Gate 3. McDonald's hairline, KSI forehead, Balding Gate 3, Cambro has been Do timed out for security? 10 minutes. Someone keeps breaking into my house at night and pushing back my hairline. I know it's Bob from accounting. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm, I'm close to my breaking point. I'm close to my breaking point. Twenty pounds heavier XQC. Twenty pounds heavier XQC. I mean, okay, that's probably true Hello, because Mr. I could actually do a single push up. I could do a single push up. What can little bro do? Have you have you seen the video of XQC running? Ru have you seen the video of XQC running on the treadmill? By the way, ha have we seen that? Have we seen that? Zero hairline, seven chins. Have we seen the video of XQC running on the treadmill? Like, like, like you're making fun of me right now. Look at this. He runs like an old woman! <laughs> that is, that is, uh, that is painful. That is painful. Why is he, he's so skinny, but he's still built like a fridge. Very interesting build. Alright, shut up. Uh, what we got? Used horseshoe, thank god. Congratulations, employee. Your high accuracy rate is awarded you today's daily coupon, used horseshoe. Our stock of used horseshoes are as reliable as they are rusty. 90% of our supply are verifiably forged from real iron. Supplies run out quickly, so stock up while you can. To receive your discount, simply type the following code into your online checkout. A great deal for shoe -er. Wow. Three dollars off a used horseshoe. Thank God. Thank God. All right. Oh, broadcast. The real estate update. Has anyone has anyone seen that house that was available to buy? And it was like on, it was on like Sneed Avenue. Hang on. I, I, I gotta show you guys this. This, I, I genuinely thought this was parody. Like, I'm, I'm not joking. It's, hang on, here it is. This is real, by the way. This is not a parody. This is not a joke. Searching for the perfect home? <laughs> <laughs> it's, 
Imagine, imagine living rent free on Cope Road, Sneedville. Featuring two bedrooms. Two bedrooms on Cope Road. With one full bathroom. Imagine living rent free there. This on property is currently <laughs> listed for under $110,000. $100,000! That is such good money as well! Like, I'm just thinking of UK house prices. Sneedville is like 20 minutes from me. Bro, That that's so good. That's so good. You should. That's like a heritage site, bro. That that's amazing. Dollars. Everyone's saying I've leaked my home address. <laughs> the cope house. <laughs> it looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. A showing. For more information or to schedule a showing, please contact the listing agent. A hundred thousand dollars for seventeen Cope Road, Sneedville. Imagine living rent free. <laughs> Imagine living rent free on Cope Road in Sneedville. Uh, right, shut up. $84,000, one bedroom, two bathrooms. That is... That is a better offer than Cope Road, Sneedville. That is a better offer. Damn, I might move into that house. $100,000, two bedrooms, three bathrooms. Oh, that's good. That, that, that's, that's, a, that's, a, that's a mighty fine price. That's a good price. She stop stop doing that. Stop I doing are... the knocking dono. Uh. Stop doing the knocking dono. It's so unfunny. I actually thought that, that I thought it was something in the game then. Thank you, hairline. So you are the hairline god of these lands. I think the story has exaggerated your hairline, brother. I'm convinced that, like, everyone watching the stream right now, apart from Windigoon, you're all just, like, you, you went bold at the age of, like, 10. And you're just coping. And you couldn't afford a hair transplant. So that, so, so, that, so then you see me, and you just start saying, over and over, hairline, 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 trying to sigh up me. You know, you know, you know the stress, the mental stress you're putting me under right now? If anything, it's just going to accelerate me going bold. Hundred and twenty K for four bedrooms, five bathrooms. That is crazy. Like how affordable American houses are. That is insane. Community alert. A civil authority has issued a missing persons alert for the following counties. Can you shut up? I'm trying to look at the houses. Uh Peanut Avenue. Peanut, my nuts. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms. Bush County, Maple County, Parkway County, Berry County. I don't care. This is a missing persons alert. Authorities are currently looking for missing child Robbie Parker, male, brown hair, approximately four feet tall, last seen wearing a yellow shirt, brown shorts, and white tennis shoes. Suspect is described to be approximately six feet tall, barefoot, wearing a large bush or shrub on their person. Last seen at approximately 10:25 a.m. Please report any unusual activity to your local authorities. Unlucky. What are you saying? What are you saying? I'm missing. What are you saying? I'm missing. It says it says a missing child. I don't get it. 
Pyro go on estrogen, it grows your hairline backhand. Gives you a fat ass like you've always wanted. Thank you, Fnatic, for the 10. Why are you saying I went missing? Approximately four feet tall. Approximately four feet tall. I don't know how many times I need to like get up and demonstrate how massive I am. Six foot seven beast. I was gonna roast Byro for having a glass chin, but that many panels of glasses got count for something. Thank you, Anonymous, for the 10. No, guys, he's like three foot tall. What's your name, little bro? Jaw Qua Gaming. Is that Chinese? Who cares? You're banned. There you go, five minutes. Fuck off. Welcome employee to begin shift, please clock in below. You guys are stone locking me more than Hassan! Stop saying the same joke over and over! I feel I feel like Hassan Piker reading chat right now. Who the hell did someone disagree with me? Oh, I'm gonna pull up your entire Twitch history on, on stream and embarrass you. Oh. <clears throat> I'm waiting for the woman to call me. Hi, Carol. You should now have access to more extensive information to work with for your future calls. Please be sure to read these new... Carol, that's great. ...you can continue providing our clients with accurate diagnoses. Please remember that this information is strictly confidential and not to be shared with anyone unless pertinent to a caller's needs. Thank you. Bye, Carol. <laughs> Bye. All right, permissions updated. Uh, this let's is wait. A missing hairline report a local British man named Pyro has lost all of his hair. Brain, hey man, love the content recently. Have you thought of making a Soma video? Played it recently and unironically had an effect on my mental health. Chat is brain dead. Thank you for the 10. Soma's amazing, I do want to do a video on it. or growl or anything, but I haven't gotten close enough to it to find out what it is since it's always just lurking out of sight from the top of the stairs. I need someone to come get this thing out of my basement as soon as possible. I've locked the door since I can still hear the steps creaking under its weight down there. Okay, that is definitely the slug, right? Please hold. That's the slug. That is 100% the slug. But I want to I wanna see the rest yeah, of what we got. Pyro, I love your content, but lately it has increased in quality and you put too much effort in your slop. Can you please play crab game again sometime? I'm begging you. Please. Crab game lover. No bias there. Thank you for the tin. You look like the live action cat in the hat, Hassan Mulligan. You look like a live action cat in the hat. I want to break your jaw. <laughs> I, 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 I've reached the point that I'm just threatening viewers with physical violence now. Okay, I, th I think he said uh, as big as my dog. Almost as big as my dog. Doesn't hiss or growl. Haven't gotten close enough to find out what it is. Just out of sight from the top of the stairs. Yeah, it's going to be a stair slug. It's going to be a stair slug. I, I, I'm just going to pick stair slug. Because that's so obvious like, what it is. We did it. All right, what else we got? T Sprite. They feed off tea and leaf residue. So, so that's just a British person. They they feed off leaf tea leaves. Why is everyone saying wrong? How is it wrong? Would you ever consider playing Blasphemous and doing a main channel video on it? 
It's a Souls-like game that's a side-scroller with a lot of really hey, nice visuals uh, and music. Really Maybe Blasphemous is really good. I'm not sure what it can mean. It just makes this nasty sound anytime I run it. Along with this... Ugh, nasty smell. Ugh. Bathroom faucet. Ah, oh, that could be the uh, the little oh hub, God. right? I want to look at the rest. Toilet hub. Let's have a look. Toilet hubs are a subspecies of hub that are known for homing inside toilets. They bear false faces and have two separate clumps of wispy hair on each side of their heads. I'm not reading the rest of that. I'm not reading the rest of that. I know, I know what chat's going to say. Unicorn fungi. Isn't that just a dog? I oh, know it's, it's on the, the, the growth there. Horn-shaped fungus that grow on the heads of furry mammals and household pets. They often affect the animal's disposition, causing them to be drawn to the soil. They report that their pets furiously digging around or inside their home. Whistling fungi. Small mushroom-like growths frequently grow through drywall gaps. They often report a distant whistling sound. Wine sprite. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We got the resident alcoholic. You look like if Chris from Until Dawn got his face stretched by a taffy puller. The official pyro copy passed a pregnant furry jad inflation hairline hub on Lucky Bald Cope Keemster XQC has in British Pet Scop 1984 Skabidi. Why are they still donating? I have decimated an entire pantheon of gods and talked no jitsu Thor. But even I consider your hairline ungodly. Skipping that one, skipping that one, skipping that one, skipping that one. Hey, Pyro. Found you from the Cry of Fear video and have been binging your content since. But I got to ask how can you cover amazing Half Life mods but not cover Under Hell? Love the content, keep it up. Uh, because Under Hell isn't finished. Under Hell isn't finished. The wine sprite are a subspecies of sprites that are known for consuming wine, so they're just middle-aged women, basically. Large-eyed winged creatures. Let's not bully Pyro. He's doing his best working a 9-to-5 at a call center to afford a hair transplant. I I'm skipping that one, I'm skipping that one. Stop making the hairline jokes! Stop making the hairline jokes! Like, like... First couple of times, it's funny, but you have one joke, one joke. Mirror nymph. Stealing the likeness of homeowners. Memory wisp. Due to a clerical error, the audio sample is incorrect. This will be corrected by the end of the month. Invisible and odorless wisps. Removing memories from the home and its homeowners. Report missing pictures, photo albums, inability to remember the faces of loved ones. They're not a danger to the physical health, but they can affect memory. We'll move out of the house on their own. Since they've stolen away then. Wait, that's awful. The solution is basically, yeah, just, just give them dementia and then they'll leave. Lamp sprites. Lamp sprites are a common subspecies of sprite that make their homes inside lamp fixtures. Good day, Slopper. Cool stream so far. But will there a day when you will stream any, if not all, the Stalker games? Stream the Stalker games. I mean, that that's a bit of a big ask. Hey, can you stream uh, every Stalker game and each one's like 50 hours? False rose bush. That those are legs. They chase down prey with their legs. False artifact. 
Yeah, there's like something in that TV. Bogart. Uh oh. Yo, this dude kinda does look like Chris from Until Dawn Lamau. They've said their targets when they're asleep. That was a bit spooky. Do not, under any circumstances, refer to a bog art by any name. Once you become aware of its presence, simply vacate the premises. Do not speak to the bog art at any time. It will remain in its original location. So what's he said? I've been hearing some weird noises coming from the bathroom. Not sure what it is. Uh, isn't that the... Uh, it's the... Where's the hub again? Here's some weird noises coming from the bathroom faucet. This nasty sound anytime I run it, along with this nasty smell. Uh, Tube-like structures such as pipes, they bear no false face, they are much smaller than most hubs. They will commonly emerge at night and consume any dirt or grime. Uh, leaks or clogs, mischievous acts. I don't think I, I don't think it's a a pipe hub. Is it a pipe growth? Weird noises coming from the bathroom faucet. Nasty sound anytime I run it. Damp tube block -like structures, such as pipes. I think it's a pipe growth, right? What do, what do we think? What do we think? Chat. What do we think? I think it could be I think it could be a pipe growth. Because it says damp tube like structures. And obviously like a like, like a pipe would get pretty wet, right? Oh my god, chat, you are actual AIDS. This chat is actually insufferable. Everyone's just doing the same bit saying Mike's muted. It's like the same people spamming as well, not clogged. Oh yeah, they clog the pipe. True. Really weird noises. Not sure what it could mean. This nasty sound, along with the... It's the smell as well. <sighs> oh, wood secretion. Sink hub? It might be. But the smell though, the smell doesn't make sense. Before the death of Brock, Sindri mentioned he had another dwarven cousin. Are you by chance the aforementioned dwarf he talked about? No. Frozen pipe? Uh, it could be. I, mean, I don't really know this one. Cracks and leaks. Oh, faucet smells. Ah, faucet smells, chat. I think it is frozen pipes. Really weird noises. Banging, whistling. This nasty sound anytime I run, along with this nasty smell. Yeah, it's that one. Whoever said, whoever said frozen pipe, you're an OG. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> so someone in chat said, get hopped. GET HOPPED! Oh. Iron brew? Yeah, it's like ice cream flavor. Unlucky. Unlucky. My wife. I don't care. I, can't see I don't face. care. I don't care. I can't see her face. I don't care. She did it. I can't see her face. They're all gone. It's all gone. I don't care. Please hold. Yeah, you got. It sounds like you got some frozen pipes there, buddy. Uh, this will be that that memory hub, right? Where is it? The memory wisp. Uh, Odalus, uh, removing memories from their home, report missing pictures, photo albums, remember to remember, yeah, it's, it's, it's that one. Her face, her face, her face fell off. I can't see her face, she's dead. I can't see her face. Yeah, that'll be a memory wisp. I like how the way to fix a memory wisp is, like, literally just let them drain all the memories out of the guy, and then it'll move on. Wait, someone said mirror nymph? What did you say mirror? Stealing the likeness of homeowners. Not being able to recognize their own face. No, 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 he said his wife's face. He said, he said, he said, he said his wife's face. such a big old mess left behind by your pest control team. Just tons of twigs, sticks, and pebbles. Sod, and I ain't putting up with it no more. I got sawdust coming out of my drawers here. I to grab you by the gold. Don Polo's back. Get around till next Sunday. Now, what you gonna do? What you gonna do to make this right? Ever since such a big old mess. Tons of sticks, twigs, pebbles. Got sawdust coming out my drawers. Thank you, Clemen, for the 10 gifted. Appreciate it, man. Nah, nah, nah. It was definitely a memory wisp. It wasn't a mirror nymph. There was no way it was a mirror nymph. They can't recognize their own face. He said he can't recognize his wife's face. He said they're all gone. It was definitely a memory wisp. Don't, don't fuck with me like this, chat. Don't. I, I reckon I got it right. Oh, that's that's the bed teeth. That's the bed teeth. My legs itch like crazy. Do I need to be showering more often or something? I usually shower like once a week for my skin health, so maybe that's it. Shower once a week? Once a week? Oh my god! I don't even know if I want to help this guy or not. No, I might just lie to him and say it's frozen pipes. I shower once a week. Most hygienic pyro van. That's crazy. Alright, let's do bed teeth. I mean, that was pretty obvious it was bed teeth. Asmongold viewer. <laughs> Have you seen Asmongold's like actual bedroom? Hang on. I gotta, I gotta show this. I gotta. Sh I, I know, I know everyone's seen it. I know everyone's seen it. I know everyone has seen it. But 
This is uh this is pretty bad. This is thirteen years ago. Thank you, Clement, for the five gifted. Hello everyone. Um heard a lot of people saying that I uh exaggerate things, I you know, make things more than what they are. And that's true. But not in terms of my room. A lot of people think that uh it's actually not as bad as it is. And I'm probably gonna clean it today, but I don't want I don't wanna lose the memory. I don't wanna lose the memory as he's zooming in on like How hang on. How old is Asmund Gold? Thirty four? So he's like eight years older than me. So he was like he was like twenty. You're watching this at the PS5? It makes sense, there's nothing else to use for it. I'll lose the memory. And so, got three drinks here. This is McDonald's. McDonald's. Uh, Long John Silver's. The fuck is that? Whataburger. Taco Bell. Shoes. That thing I found in the street. Um, that's one, that's my... Look at that. Um. Look at that. Here's my desk. There you go. My character, fucking awesome. This is Drake. Thank you, Clemen, again, for the five gifted. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. And I've got up here, we have some Whataburger numbers. Some fucking Mountain Dew. More... It's not that bad. Ah, oh, this is the worst one. Uh, what is up with the cup? The cup yeah, the, the, this is his, like, recent setup. Look at the amount of sauce he has here from, like, Chick-fil-A or whatever that is. What are you talking? That's obviously this Wendy's is how my mom's chili. Here. I bet that's the room right now. That is Warcraft. No wonder why it looks this way. Okay. <laughs> I, 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 oh, those are I, new bags of chips too. Well, yeah, and and here, I, and here, but and, that's trash. And the party boxes not, of, of right there. Yeah, we oh were we, we were chilling. That. Yeah, I'm probably. We were chilling. We were chilling. Why are they like this? Because uh, honestly, streamers just make money like streaming all day. So they don't really care about hygiene and stuff. I mean, I, I I saw videos of like XQC's room. The thing is, I as much as I could sit here and say, "Oh, that's disgusting!" Like, what a what a what a gremlin you are, little wriggly gremlin. I'm actually jealous because like if if there is one thing out of place in my room, I can't work. Like if there's like a plate in my room, I can't work. I need everything to be like so clean. I mean, my my desk right now is probably like. My, my desk right now is probably the dirtiest it's ever been, but it's still not that bad. Hang on. Let me, let me, let me try and show off. So that my desk right now, I don't know, what have I got? Uh, I mean, you've got all the, uh, I don't know, it's like, there's like a can there of Iron Brew that I was drinking. You got the, you got the gamer subs here and that's like, that's got, let's throw, look at that mo! Mold. Look at that! I just made the point how my room is cleaner. Look at that mold! Oh my god! That's that's like a biohazard. It's growing on the bottom as well. That's a biohazard. I need to. That's that that is gonna melt through the plastic. That is actually gonna melt through the plastic. Uh, I got some I got some chewing gum here. Uh, this is like invoices that I need to get, but I'm too lazy. Uh, I have a f I have a gun here. Uh, you know, if it, if if it, if it, if, it, if, it, if it all gets a bit too much, uh, I got air up there, but I don't have it on stream anymore because they, I got paid. Uh, I got my Go XLR. Uh, I got I got Discord. Uh, I got my my M and S sparkling water bottle. I got uh, glasses. These glasses that I wear when I work, uh, they're not prescription. Uh, they're just a plastic lens, but it's like a blue light filter. Because apparently blue light is like bad for your eyesight. And and fun fact, these are the exact same glasses that Paul Dano wore when he was the Riddler in the Batman film. Like like it's the same brand. It's the same brand and type of glasses. It's not like the glasses that he wore. Uh, and then and then and then I got uh, I got I got stress balls as well. Uh, that one's like kind of you know thinking emoji. Uh, that one's that one's kind of angry. That one as well. Uh, and then, and then I got, uh, 
the best investment I got from from Sony is the the PS5 cup. Uh, inside it, there's no games. There's just a bunch of pens. Uh, there's a there's a there's a book there's a book here that PewDiePie suggested in a video. Uh, epic, epic, t t e epic. How, f how do you say that? Epic, epic, epic. Tetus, epic Tetus, epicetus. I don't know. I don't know. But but PewDiePie said that that was like uh, he said that was a book that he read. Uh, I've also got uh, I got these as well, like Supreme for my because I'm a complete wristlet. Watching the stream in the hospital. I was supposed to get out today, but my nurse asked who I was watching. I will now be staying. I got uh, I got a chocolate as well. I think it's been sat here about Thank two years. I never ate it. It's a Guinness. It's a Guinness chocolate. I might I might eat it and get drunk on stream. MNS waiter, you Tory. Okay. I'm gonna eat the uh, I'm gonna eat the Guinness chocolate. I don't even think it has alcohol in it. Uh, thank you again, Clemen, for the five gifted, man. Much appreciated. Eat it. I mean, I don't even know if it has alcohol in it. Probably got, like, a bit of a Guinness. Oh, it actually tastes like Guinness. That's disgust. That's disgusting. Ow. That's disgusting. Yeah, that, that tastes like ass, bro. Why would you have Guinness chocolate? Oh. Alright, anyway. Oh. Oh, that, that tastes disgusting. Hello? I was told Hi. I number to ask about my problem. No. The wall in my bedroom doesn't look right near the bottom. The bottom of the wall has some cracks, or maybe it's peeling? I'm not sure. I have a cat named Whiskers, and sometimes he likes to sharpen his claws at the couch, but he would never do that to the wall. He knows just how naughty that would be. Please hold. It could be frozen pipes. It could be, let me cook, it could be frozen pipes. I do, kinda, I, I, I do just want to lie to her. I was told to call this number to ask about my problem. The wall in my bedroom doesn't look right near the bottom. The bottom of the wall has some cracks, or maybe it's peeling. It could be, thank you Clemen again for the five gifted. Why are you gifting so many little bro? But thank you, I appreciate it man. Thank you, thank you. It could be, okay, no, don't say fracture hub. I'm not picking it, I'm not picking it. You made it such an unfunny bit. I'm not picking it. I'm not picking it out of principle. It probably is the hairline hub, but I'm not picking it. I'm not. You you, you dragged the bit on too much that you guys have actually ruined the 100% run. I'm not picking it. I'm not picking it. Hello, Pyro. I want you to say hi, Liam, that you love him. Much thanks. Hey, Lee, fuck off, mate. Thank you for the $10, Oracle. Uh... I have a cat named Whiskers, sometimes likes to sharpen his claws on the couch. Don't be a fracture hub. Don't, I, I didn't want to ever pick this thing. I didn't want to ever pick this thing. I don't even want to look at it. Nah, I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm putting, I'm putting my webcam over it. I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. Cracks and fractures in the walls and homes. Wait, but she didn't say, she said the, the wall in my bedroom cracks or maybe it's peeling okay I think it is a fracture hub god damn it yeah I think I, th I think I think it is a fracture hub I think it's a hairline hub it's a hairline hub <sighs> someone said the webcam disappeared that's funny. You're getting timed out for that one, buddy. I might just ban you. I'm so sick of seeing that joke. It's termites. It wasn't termites. Was it termites? P 
Peeling paint. Nah. Nah. Nah, we got it right. We, it was hairline hop. We got it right. We got it right. Dude, look how happy he is. Some kind of joke? Last week, I called you guys about... Me, 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 me. ...coming from my living room. And the info... Me, 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 me. ...something about leaving out a bowl of cream? What kind of joke is that? It's been a week now that I've been dealing with this racket, no thanks to you, and now we're starting to have power outages. Your employee's stupid joke is now probably going to cost me who knows how much in repair costs. So talk to your manager and tell them they owe me big time. Wee. You figure out what's Wee. going on in my house and you figure it out now! The stream's down. Yeah, I, I would have actually believed that if it wasn't the same guy copy-pasting it 19 times within the past two minutes! I'm telling you out. I, I'm ta I'm tapping you out for 10 minutes for that one. I'm tapping you out for 10 minutes. Please hold. Last week I called you guys about some I weird know noises. I this game. I'm actually spending money to tell you it's not the fracture hop. It's termites. It was termites? Can I go back? God damn it. Peeling paint, small holes, and squeaky floorboards. Okay, Gabby for the 10. It might be over then. Uh, weird noises from the living room. Leaving out a bowl of cream. Chat, which one is this? Which one, which one is this? I called you guys about some weird noises from the living room. Tell him you love him, you piece of shit. Much love. Thank you, Oracle, for the 15. No, fuck off. $1,000 and I will. A bugger? Is it a bugger? Some weird noises from the living room. And leaving out a bowl of cream. It's been a week now. I've been dealing with this racket. Starting to have power outages. Does a bug out cause power outages? Thank you, Clemen, again, for the 10 gifted. Much appreciated, man. Thank you. Thank you, Dranov, for the 50 euro. Around 10 months ago, you wanted to try Roblox doors. Oh, yeah, I need to. I do need to try doors. I was, I was planning on doing a main channel video on it, which would be kind of funny. A common hub? Um, no, 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 no. It says here, it says here, it says here. Causing accidents, flooding, fires, electrical outages. Bugger is the general term. Hairy humanoids. Household accidents, flooding, fires. But it, it doesn't say anything about noise, though. I don't know. Should we, should we say bugger? Yeah, the cream bit is what I don't understand. Look for the cream bowl. It evolved into a bug art. It's a bug art because he didn't leave out the cream. Oh, wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. With the common harp. Hang on, hang on. Yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. One should leave out a bowl of cream or milk. Oh, 
All uh, right, but by the look of what he's saying, he never actually left out the cream. So yeah, I think I think it's a bug up. Thank you, Clemen, again for the five gifted. Drink the mold juice from the PS5 cup. Merge with the mold. Become the mold. <laughs> the PS5 has no mold. It's got no mold on it because it'd need games to grow the mold. No! We fucked it. We fucked it. We fucked it. We actually fucked it. 83%. There's no there's no email. It's over. I might quit. I might quit. I'm, I'm going to see if I can cheese it. I'm going to I'm going to see if I can cheese it. Okay. I, th I think we're doing the day again. So I'm going to I'm going to do everything I picked before, but then I'm going to pick the termites. I'm going to pick the termites. Cuz I I really want to get 100% rating. Play doors. Holy shit, mods. Can we time out people spamming the same message 20 times? Like, you can, you can ask me to play a game, but, like, if you just copy-paste it 20 times, like, I, I'm, I'm not going to want to touch it. Hello. Shut, up. Shut, up. Shut 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 up. Also, do you work out? If so, let me see the sleeper bill. Shut up! Shut up! Okay, I don't have to click on every single one of these to close them, right? There's no way. I think... There's no way I have to click on every single one of these. Oh my god. Okay, this is the worst, this is the second worst mistake I've made in my life. Oh my god. Why did I do this? And if you click up Oh my god, this is the worst mistake I've ever done in my life. Why did I do this? Hey Mr. Dot Slop God, been watching you since 2019 and you have never failed to entertain. Thank you for being you. Why did I do this? Hold illicit substances really well in Minecraft. Why did I? Why did I do this? Door underscore knock. I might actually have to restart. That was that was horrible. That was horrible. What do you mean stalling? I didn't know I had to close each window individually. Fuck off. Right. Hello. There's something in the basement. I've seen it. It's huge. Almost as big as my dog. It doesn't hiss or growl or anything, but I haven't gone close enough to it to find out what it is since it's always just lurking out of sight from the top of the stairs. I need someone to come get this thing out of my basement as soon as possible. I've locked the door since I can still hear the steps creaking under its weight down there. Alright, what was it again? Oh yeah, this is the uh, slug. Thank you, Clement, again for the five gifted. Or is it Toilet Hob, T Sprite, Stair Slug? I can't wait for my Gamer Slops Cup to get here. Also, I'm going to watch the entirety of the funny yellow show video as soon as stream is done. Thank you, Brandon, for the 10. Appreciate it. Bathroom. 
Don't care. Don't care. Right, this was frozen pipes, right? Yeah, Clemens probably dished out like 50 gifted subs by now. Thank you very much, brother. Right. Okay, uh, this was frozen pipes from what I remember. Pyro, when is pet? Pet. IT hurts. The voice is Pyro the voices. <laughs> Ever since that video, I've gone insane. You are to blame. Uh, -huh. uh I've gone insane. Uh, the same dono over and over. Now I don't have to pay. Brokey. My wife. We, my wife. Uh, my wife. My wife. Uh, uh, my wife. My wife. I can't see her face. I can't see her face. Hello Pyro, been watching you since the Kimsar oh drama, even though I absolutely detest the Slop channel, Unlucky. I get why it exists, as if old Pyro wasn't, daily Slop as well keep up the good work, much love. Thank you Kane for the 10, much appreciate. Fracture hub, frozen pipes, go for, what was it again? Where is it, where is it again? Memory wisp. It was memory. It was it was mirror nymph. People thought it was mirror nymph. Stealing the likeness. Large mirror that they beckon others to look into. They report not being able to recognize their own face. Nah, it's memory wisp. It's memory wisp. Definitely memory wisp. I can't believe that other one was termites, though. Like, how? I cannot remember my little wife's face. I've been streaming too long. Click the text in the textbook to skip the dialogue. Oh, nice, you can just skip. Ah, oh, okay. Termites cause paint peeling. Well, what, do you, do you have termites in your house every day? Like, how do you know that? This is the black guy again. No. My sheet's growing. Oh, this is the... This is the bed teeth, man. Yeah, this is Mr. Bed Teeth. No. Bed teeth. Thank you, Clement, again, for the five gifted. Someone in the chat owes me a kiss. Very true. I think you would enjoy a game called Lunacid. It's a dungeon crawler with PS to graphics. Lot of lore. I, also, play, I played Lunacid. I played Lunacid. Hello? I was told to call this number to Please call Okay, it. termites. Termites. So we think it's termites. Some cracks, or maybe it's peeling. Ah, oh, I think it was termites. I like how I butchered the very last question as well, like, of course. Yeah, Lunas, it's cool, because you can upload, like, your own icon to be your avatar. I did that. Stop doing the knock! Hey, Byro. Drifter Ducky again. What game was this again? Anyways, glad you liked the carbonation slash burp flavor <laughs> thing from earlier. Been loving the content, but for fuck's sake, clean the game a subs cup, please, for the love of God. As Mungild Cup. I actually feel physically... I, I felt physically sick the past week. It might be because of that cup. Do you think this is some kind of joke? Please no, this call. is... this is Bogart. 100%! 
Yeah, cheers, cheers Gabby for telling me it was uh, termites. Right, what's the coupon? What is the coupon? I must know what the coupon is. I must know what the coupon is. I must know what the coupon is. I am so excited for the coupon. I need the coupon. Right, that guy stopped e emailing me, thank god. Right. Hello! Home Safety Hotline family, we're excited to introduce to all of our brand new office pet, Whiskers. Whiskers is loyal, friendly, and is as serious about pet's control as we are. Please give Whiskers a warm welcome if you see him wander by your desk. Please note, refrain from picking up or feeding Whiskers, as he's still getting to know everyone in the office, and has scheduled feeding times. Sincerely, HSH Corporate. Okay, that that's an orange cat. I'd throw that out the window straight away. I would throw him out the window. Or orange cats are evil, evil little Hi, creatures. Hello. Love the main channel vids. We'll be honest though, the first 40 minutes of the Lethal Company vid felt like filler. The video is about the hidden law, not a review of the whole game, so it felt like it was a bit too fat. Anyways, have a good one. Thank you, Fox, for the 10. I, I, I don't know what to tell you, bro. Like, you're, you're, you're telling me that it's too fat. You're, 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 you're telling me that it's too fat. Like, come on. Whiskers is the cat from the previous caller. Oh my god, it is! Yeah, 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 yeah! The, the woman that called about the termites. This is the cat. This is the same cat. Yeah, because that was called Whiskers as well. L opinion. Well, you just reported yourself as an orange cat owner, buddy. Alinity moment. <laughs> Alright, what we got? 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 Okay. HSH deals. Congratulations, employee. Your high accuracy rate has awarded you today's daily coupon. A silver medallion. It's 100% pure silver and comes free with an iron chain for convenience. For safety in both... In and out of the home, never let the medallion leave your sight. Supply is limited to one, so get it when you can. To receive the, your discount, simply type the following code during your online checkout. Pedal to the metal. Keep up the good work, employee. All right. Uh, so, apparently, we're not allowed to let the medallion leave our sight, which is interesting. Oh, new video, new video, new video, new law, new law, new law, new law. Ain't no way he's this excited. Shut up, bro. I would love to work a 9 to 5 and get a gold sticker. Shut up. Look at that skybox. Science mysteries. The mystery of mice. I feel like I'm watching, uh, what's it called again? I feel like I'm watching, uh... Hey boss, can I get a cheeseburger? What's that one with the planets? What's, what, what's the analog horror with the planets? What's it called? What's it called? Gemini! Yeah, yeah, there you go, Gemini catalog. Mice. From humanity's oldest friends and oldest enemies. From the Black Plague to the shelves of our pet stores, mice have lived alongside humans for centuries. And just like humans, mice may even be evolving alongside us as well. Mice. This is a mus musculus. Mice. mice. Known as the common house mouse. And this is Mus Musculus Loquentis, otherwise known as the Smart Mouse, a newly discovered species known for its uniquely colored iris, and more importantly, its increased intelligence. Mice have brains smaller than peanuts, and yet, modern science has observed they are capable of thinking quite intelligently, and in the case of the Smart Mouse, perhaps even capable of communication. With the help of modern computer technology, 
Today's scientists have been able to interpret the previously indecipherable squeaks of a smart mouse and have discovered what seems to be hidden messages within. Let's take a listen. Squeak. Let's give us a kill them all, enslave humanity. I'm a rat, help me. Is this a wonder of evolution? Or are we just hearing things that aren't there? Do mice and men have more in common than previously thought? Well, I suppose that's what makes this a science mystery. The rats, the rats, we're the rats. What's that, what's that, what's that one again? The German, the rats? The rats, the rats. Hey Pyro, the just rats. finished the Half-Life 3 video. Great job on it, hopefully you can get the rights to the song for the vid. All the best, and thanks for making me laugh since 2018. Thank you Nate for the 10. Rats, we're the rats, we're the rats. Good night, we it's dark at night, we're the rats. I'm the giant rat. That makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of troll we can Good morning, Pyrocynical. I've been on quite the goon sesh lately and are my next streamer to Gunto. After I saw your feet, I just could help myself. Clean up on his all my pants. Your big toe brings me a lot of joy. The goon cup is almost full. Thank you for the $10, Pyro Fetical. I might be depressed, I'm not really sure, like... I just get these donos and they're just slowly breaking down my mental barrier. Like, you you, you guys are like a pork tapeworm. Like, you get in my body and, and then you're like meningitis, you, you you just infect the brain. It's it's just mental torture. Like, I could, I could be kidnapped by the Chinese and like, water dripped. Like, like a drop of water on my head. To, to break me, and I would still break slower than the donos that these people send me. Thank you, Clement, for the five gifted. Alright, are we done? Uh, are we done living? Alright, next one. Pyro, the donos are weakening Pyro's <laughs> AT field. <laughs> It's like you had to do, you had to do an Evangelion reference. Cle Clement is carrying. I, 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 I'm happy that I have like Russian oil barons that are just giving obscene amounts of money. I could, I could, I could, I am like 0.1% of the way there to feel like what it's like for Amaranth to make $57 million from showing her tatas. Did you see, by the way, that Amaranth said like, she, she said it's a bad idea to start an OnlyFans? That's like me saying it's a bad idea to become a YouTuber. Uh, guys, I've actually made a lot of money from this, but if you guys start joining as well, that's more competition. Hello, Supervisor Carol here again. I've been watching the Closely employee. Been a long time so watcher and just want to say to love the content. Thank you, cup of coffee for the 10. So you should have access to more extensive household hazard information. Keep up the great work, employee. Our eyes rest upon you. Our eyes rest upon thee. Okay, that was a little bit spooky. Alright, what we got? Attic Gnome. Ooh. Nice. Cellar Grotto. What is that? It's a cave-like network that appears spontaneously in cellars. That's weird. I've been having the worst kind of stomach bug, just aches and pains constantly. But after a month, it still hasn't gone away, and I'm thinking there's got to be something wrong with the water, because we only eat fresh, homegrown... Paro, how was your British day so far? Also, do you work out? If so, let me see the sleeper build. Hope the rest of your day is good. Love the content. Thank you, Lucas. 
Okay, 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 okay. Let me cook here. Let me cook. This is a fake beat, right? This is all like a red herring thing that is going on about the faucet. Because there is nothing about the water becoming dirty. The, the, the midget that lives in the pipes, he cleans the water. So I think this is a fake beat because he says, Ah, oh, we only eat fresh fruit and veg. So I think he ate a fake beat. I'm cooking. I'm cooking. Alright, let me, let me... I'm just looking in case there's anything else. Faux feast, edible food st substances, flour, cornmeal. It's a species of fungi. Not dangerous if consumed. Faux fungi. Oh, not what the hell? Floor roots. The horde. What the fuck is the horde? Invisible odorless collective consciousness that is known to collect and store large quantities of common household refuse. It is advised to sell one's home at the first sight of the Horde's presence. I do like how most of the ways to resolve this is like, yeah, GG, GG, we tried, just, just sell up. Laundry gnome. Team star. Right, night gnome. Night gnomes are small hairy creatures with a pointed head. They're known for their tendency to enter the sleeping quarters of humans to watch them while they sleep. Nice. Night wisp. They're known to hover outside windows and whisper promises of wealth and good fortune. They're not dangerous unless listened to. They'll move on after a week if they're ignored consistently. It's advised to drown out their whispers with music or wear sleep masks to prevent sleep disruption. Portal. Door shaped opening to other locations. I like that, I like that. They can introduce dangerous elements and should be dealt with. Additionally, they can cause drafts. <gasps> Not a draft in the house! Oh my god! Hey Pyro, just wanted to say thank you for your content and the slop. I sometimes just watch longer videos because they still give me the good serentanin. You also would kill for your hairline. Don't know what every own's about. Yeah, would own. Thank you. Thank you, small hairy creature for the ten. Travel gnome. Right, I reckon this is false beat. I reckon this is false beat. The harmless unless eaten, which point they'll take root in your stomach, feeding off nutrients, then cause digestive issues and back problems. Does he complain about back problems? Stomach bug, aches and pains. He does say pains though. There's got to be something wrong with the water, because we eat fresh fruits. We've never had any problems. I keep hearing things about the rusty pipes, water po poisoning. There, there's nothing, there's not a single thing about water poisoning in any of these. So it's got to be fake, like fake beat, right? Let's send it off. Alright, what else we got? Frozen pipes? Uh, Surely not. I hope it wasn't frozen pipes. I mean, he didn't complain about a noise, though. Just 
staring into the house. When I close the window, I can still hear him out there, breathing. I've been sleeping on the couch every night this past week, just so he won't see me. The police said they can't do anything, so please, send somebody or do something about this. I can hardly sleep anymore. I like how everyone in chat said that was the queen at Lizzie's back, and then one guy said it sounds like me. Please, oh. Right, that, that's a gnome, right? That's a gnome. Gnome slob on my knob. Right. Let's have a little look. Hello, Byron Cynical. Came in late. What is this game? Love the slop. BTW, your chat are a Lovecraftian horror escape. True. Thank you, Max the 10. What's the game? Home security hotline. Uh, somebody's stalking me. I can see their shadow at night in my window. There's got to be a night gnome, right? When I close the window, I can hear him out there. Enter the sleeping quarters of humans or watch them when they sleep. Frequently report sightings in the middle of the night or heavy breathing. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a night gnome. It's a night gnome. Wait, someone said Night Wisp. Nah. She never said talking, she's yeah. saying breathing. Colossal cameo? That, that woman is probably like 90, that's way too young to be a uh, colossal. Yeah, let's do a Night Gnome. How do you solve it? If they become bored or restless, they'll move on. All of these solutions are just like waited out. Hello, yes. Skylar White! There may be some kind of Skylar White! Lately, we've been hearing awful banging noises coming from the ceiling, and the air quality seems to have been drastically reduced. Hi, I'd like my to make a call. My my husband my husband stole the child again. Hank's dead. Walt. Thank you, Spooky for eighteen. Some kind of problem with our home ventilation. Hearing banging noises coming from the ceiling. Air quality has been reduced. My daughter has not oh. been able to stop coughing. God, that could be anything. Whistling fungi? No, she never said whistling. Banging noises from the ceiling and bad air quality and a cough. Nope. 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 The attic gnome? There, there, there was no attic gnome. Was there an attic gnome? Let's have a look. Oh yeah. Knocking or rap? Okay, I thought that was something else. Rapping sounds. <laughs> Rapping sounds coming from the ceiling. <laughs> hey, Pirate. <laughs> Just wanna say you have a mess no! of double team. Get out of my also ceiling! Your hairline Get out of my ceiling! Sincerely, man with receding hairline. Ah. Right. Okay. Uh, ventilation. All for banging from the ceiling. Uh, nest in attics. Uh, surplus. A surplus of dust. Oh, it might be an attic gnome. She said surplus, it says surplus of dust, and she did say, like, the air quality's gone to shit. A surplus of dust coming out of the ventilation systems. Uh, they can consume dust. They can be good because they can consume dust, cobwebs, household pests, 
However, when frightened, they will violently expel their meals, which can send large quantities of dust particles into the air, causing air quality issues. I think it's an attic gnome. I think it's an attic gnome. Someone, someone needs to pay him 50k to get out of the attic. <laughs> Alright, do attic them. I think I know what this is. It was a uh, a false rosebush because apparently they eat kids. But she did say the last time she saw her kid was when she put him into bed. So I don't think it's a false rosebush. He turned into a bee. I turned myself into a bee, Morty. A bee, Rick. Police refused to do anything. They told me to call you. Uh, my little boy has gone missing. He's eight years old. Such a sweetheart. Last time I saw him, tucking him into bed, checked his closet for bees. Fix that you need a second cousin. Also fix that double chin. He ate a bee. It's the that attic. Too. It's the attic. Stop saying attic. Is it? Someone said false artifact. Manifest suddenly inside a home. They're known for making gentle buzzing sounds. Can only be heard by very young humans. Children or small animals. They often report... Homeowners often report, report missing children or pets. They're not a direct threat to humans. and can pose a significant risk to small human children and animals. If they're left alone with one, they are risked of being encased in it. Once encased, no noise is made. While digestion can take several years, starvation can be more of a pressing concern. Removal is as simple as physically moving the object out of one's home. Is this the new Witcher game? Should a pet be already encased within, one can utilize a memory wisp to speed up the grieving process. Oh, that's, that's morbid, Jesus. So it's basically like, if the kid's trapped, yeah, he's fucked. Is it this one? I, is it, is it false artifact? If it's, if it's a false artifact, that kid's dead. That kid is just dead. No, it's too false. So that, that kid is just dead, and you can basically use a memory wisp to, like, speed up the process. That is dark. That is very dark. Oh, I see the buzzing. The buzzing of the bee was, like, from the... Ah, my name Jeff. Okay, okay, that, that makes sense now. Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. Alright, what's the next one? Among Us. I recently finalized the purchase and naturally afterwards found that there are several large cracks in the walls of the basement that were not previously disclosed, as well as several pieces of 
half-eaten cheese littered across the basement floor? I haven't been able to get in contact with the previous owners about this, and I'm wondering if you can offer any kind of legal advice. Stability in my new home. Several large cracks in the walls and basement that weren't disclosed, and half-eaten cheese. Is that is that the hub again? Is that the Is that the hub? The fracture hub? It might actually be the fracture hub. I don't want it to be the fracture hub though. I don't want it to be the fracture hub. Several large cracks in the wall. Fu it's it's the fracture hub. It's the fracture hub. Fun, fun. I I I really didn't want it to be the fracture hub. I hope I'm wrong. I hope I'm wrong. The hairline hub. Hello? Got rumor here. I need to place an order of 60 gallons of orange drink here. I got a big old party I'm setting up here at the studio, and we're going to need that orange drink to uh, too many mouths to feed, you know what I mean? Gonna need that orange drink to feed my brew. I thought y'all still got that cheesy greaser. Look at the size of his nose, it looks like a bull sack. Yeah, I noticed that the people that call on their faces are distorted, they just repeat the same thing over and over. Cheesy greaser. Pepper squeeze. Don't tell me I got the pepper squeeze. Pyrocynical spitting image. Look at my note. Oh. Uh oh. This one sounds different. I don't like the sound of this ring. Hey, so my doctor told me I should call this number. I have no idea why. He won't tell me anything. He said you could help, so here goes nothing, I guess. Uh, I, I guess. <laughs> No. It could be it could be frozen pipes. Is it the Oh shit. Everything's broken. Why is everything broken? Squidward looking ass. Okay, I can still submit something. I don't know what it could be. The entry could not be loaded. They're, they're all fucked. I think it's that wood secretion. Hang on, what do you say? Said you could help. Uh, I've recently been having the worst headaches. Barely woke. Found my eyes were starting to look kind of pink. Really freaked out. I'm not sure what. It's the faux flu. The faux flu. The fake flu. Okay. All right. Great fucking setup here, bro. I can't even see any of the database now. Hello. What do you want? You Dog. Man, freaking holes! I'm stepping around big wooden splinters! There's no telling how much-
much damage there is. I've got this big gaping one in my kitchen that I have no idea how freaking deep it goes. To top it all off, my skittish little greyhound goblin is nowhere to be found. She probably took off after seeing this mess. I need help. Bad. Please hold. Okay, there we go. It's back. It's back. Okay. The system's back up. What could it be? Wasn't there one about like a dog? Freaking out. Uh... Big wooden splinters damage there is. Got this big gaping one in the kitchen. I have no idea. It goes on top skittish. My greyhound is nowhere to be found. I think it's that one with the dog that has the, uh, the unicorn fungi, right? What's changed? What do you mean it's changed? I think it's unicorn fungi, right? Drawn to the soil. They're not harmful to humans, but can lead to other household problems, such as broken floorboards. Broken floorboards. Oh, that's it. There's holes all over my house. Big wooden splinters. He's not saying where. There's a big gaping one in the kitchen. I think it's- I think it's Unicorn. Because there's a picture of the dog as well, right? So... Look at that little doggy. Little dog. Please notice me, I paid extra money. No. Hello! What do you want? What do you want, sir? You're live on Dr. Phil. Isn't that just Carmella from The Sopranos? That is Carmella from The Sopranos. Look, chat. Chat, it is literally just Carmella from The Sopranos. Like, are you, are, you, are you telling me that that is not Carmella from The Sopranos? That is exactly the same. I was just making coffee, and then my husband came in and started just shouting. Started shouting. Alright, I, I, I didn't even pay attention to this. What's happening to my living room? Back on vacation, turning into a disaster. My living room is absolutely covered in soil and plants, looking like a nursery. Please hold uh... I'm back from vacation, travel gnome, maybe? Let's have a look. Highly invasive. Stay away from stone away in the luggage. They're found commonly in highly forested areas. Now, highly forested areas, they're gonna bring back soil, right? <laughs> Pyro, how would you pronounce my name last Teddy streamer called me Malty? Molt. Mute. Mutely. Mutely. How do you say that name? Thank you for the ten. I think. I think it's. I think it's this gnome. I think it's this gnome. They will often create expansive gardens inside their new home, leaving soil, plants, outdoor pests. Yeah. And back from vacation, the house is already turning into a disaster. My living room is covered in soil. Yeah. Yeah, it's travel gnome. It's travel gnome. I'm not mewing. Stop saying I'm mewing. Hello. What do you want? There's something... There's something in my basement. I don't know what it is. All I know is when I open my basement door, it smells like a damn sewer, and I can hear it making all kinds of horrible noises. It sounds like there might be a lot of water down there, too. 
I don't know what it might be doing down there, but I have a feeling it's causing a whole lot of damage. Please, send somebody to help with this. I can't deal with something like this. Something in my basement. I think it's a cellar. I think it's a cellar growth. Bad smell. High humidity. Large beetles, frogs. Uh... Cellar growers can be removed by finding their creator and presenting them with a gift of gold. Their creator often resides within the grotto's subterranean lake. Bring spelunking and snorkeling equipment on your excursion. But oh, that's at the forest. Right, uh, cellar growth. There's something in the basement, I don't know what it is. All I know is when I open my basement it smells like a sewer, and I hear it making all kinds of horrible noises. Sounds like there might be a lot of water down there. Okay, if this doesn't mention water or moisture, this isn't it. Cellar grows for a large species of fungi. Dark. Ah, oh, it says damp. Dripping, stretching, or strange glows. I don't know, it could be gro gr grotto or growth. Didn't he say flooded? There might be a lot of water down there. Bad smell. He said the smell, right? But there's also a bad smell with the cellar growths. Okay, cellar growth doesn't actually mention smell at all. So I think it's a grotto. It'd be a grotto. Uh, Gabby just carrying. Uh, 100%! We did it. Nice. That's good. That's good. That's good. Me likey. Me likey. Complete your fourth day on the job. Alright, what we got? We got more mail. Uh oh. What the hell? Do not come to the hole. The hole is breached. Repeat, the hole is breached. It's not safe here, I must find a new spot. It knows I'm here. Okay. Regarding your schedule this week, due to a shortage of available staff, we will need you to come into work this Saturday and Sunday. Thanks for being a team player. Rest assured, your additional labours will be recognised. Congratulations, employee. Your high accuracy rate has awarded you today's daily coupon. This is the Tamed River Route. Plucked and tamed straight from the waters within the undersoil, this river root is as reliable as they come. Their gentle, high-frequency cries are guaranteed to keep your garden safe from all manner of pests and predators. Just don't forget to keep them well-watered and well-monitored. To receive your discount, simply type the following code during your online checkout. Root in for you. Keep up the great work. That's a decent discount. I might buy. All right. Root in for you. Wait, someone someone in chat said that I was the cat. They said it was the cat. I might have been. Alright, let's see what we got today. Hi, Carol. Hello. Supervisor Carol here. Hi! Thine accuracy continues to impress those of us above. Thine accuracy. I have updated your permissions once more. Yeah, she's not she's not talking normally now. She she's speaking like a cult. 
Our eyes rest soundly upon that your accuracies continue to impress those above and below the soil. That's kind of spooky. Right, I'm just going to run to the toilet. I'll be back in a second. Alright. Permissions have been updated. What we got? What we got? What we got? Animation. What the hell? Capable of moving on their own. Alright. What we got? Hello, woman. They, they were Satan worshippers and they took her jobs. They took her jobs. They took her jobs. A dang tree growing in my in my job today. They took her jobs. Satan worshippers in my shed. Dungeon dragon cult. The next thing I know is I find a tree growing in my shed. I don't think this is anything I've seen before. I, I don't think this is. I don't think this is anything I've seen before. Closet labyrinth, twisting network of tunnels that are known to occasionally appear inside of the closets or wardrobes. Thank you, Liko, for joining. Uh, Dreamweaver. And known to weave dreams into reality. False flower. Cobalt. Isn't that isn't that just the, the fairy thing? Five foot tall humanoid creatures with dog like faces and they're known to burrow into dark rooms. Do not ever enter a kobold's domain. Is that it? A rain nymph. They asked to be let inside. You can ignore their pleas. Soap Sprite? They consume bacteria and harmful microbes, they occupy bathrooms, they feed off the hands that use them, they create suds like substance.
Despite their bacteria-eating lifestyle, they're known to spread diseases such as Fey flu. Oh. They just want to help. Okay, I think this is the one. I think this is Spree Tree. They found a cult in the shed. There's sh Satan worshippers in the shed. He's been gone for days. And the next thing is I find a tree growing in my shed. Yeah, I think it's Sprig. I think it's this one. I think it's Sprig Tree. Rapidly growing trees that take root in a human body. They're known to cause structural damage as they grow. I think it's this one. They're incredibly deadly to those infected and they'll result in death once they've reached a certain size. There's no cure. Infected should be quarantined. Or any others should vacate the premise immediately. Do not touch the infected person or the black substance. Didn't she say a black substance? Yeah, black liquid jazz, yeah, this one. It's it's sprig, 100 percent It's sprig tree. Oh yeah. Sprig tree. What's sprig vines? Oh shit. That might not be Oh no, it's it's not that one. It's not that one. Trash gnome. Little fella just living his best life. He's looking this is me like looking for slop topics. Some noises in my house. They still seem to be happening. I told you guys what was happening, but short story is every night I'm hearing cluttering from the kitchen. And then I check, but it's spotless. Please hold. Uh, that'd be one of the hubs, right? That'll be one of the hubs, I think. Maybe just a, a common one. Uh, I already told you what was happening, but short story is every night I'm hearing clattering coming from the kitchen. No signs, it's spotless. Uh, consume dust, dirt. Dishes. Dishes are in the kitchen. Yeah, common. Let's do that. Common hub. Easy! Easy clap. Common hub. Desk hub? Nah. Nah, definitely not. Did you? Unlucky. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> Just skip the call. Yeah, I don't care. I don't care. I I, I genuinely don't care. Let me let me let me play it again. Yeah, it's frozen pipes, lady. I don't know what to tell you. Stop calling the company. Singing. Greenhouse and taunting us. I think it's a wisp. Someone in chat said house fire, I think. Could you imagine? Dude, I gotta do a run where I just submit a house fire for every single answer. Uh, what's what's that? A demonic voices be beyond your comprehension? It's a house fire. Someone said it's a false flower. Uh, they take roots, disguising themselves. Faint singing. 
Still getting break in nah, she's just getting break-ins, though. Breaking into the greenhouse. Ah, uh, that does say singing, though. They're harmless. If they attempt to disrupt or remove them, they'll lash out by spraying a toxic chemical known to cause blindness or loss of sight. False flowers are not to be disturbed once they've taken root. Water regularly and try not to notice their presence. Ignore their singing. It's not a false flower. Oh, it is a false flower. Yeah, I think it's a false flower. It might be a house fire. I kind of want to. I kind of want to tell her it's just a house fire. There you go. I was. I was so close to saying house fire. You have no idea. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you, lady. It's either frozen pipes or a house fire. I don't know. It's one or the other. Stop calling this number. She said it was in the greenhouse, not in the house. I mean, that's still part of the house. I don't know. It's just singing, though. Look at this guy. I got two dumbbells that I bought from you that need a good spit shine. Know what I mean? I mean, these bells have got all kinds of grit, grime, grease. Can't even see my face in them when I'm deadlifting. Know what I mean? I mean, I'm looking at these bells right now here. I'm seeing the uh, spit, crud, and juice. And, uh... Hey, who, who are you? How did you get in? Hey, now, now easy there. Get away. Get away. What the hell? Is that Hector Salamanca? Last chance to look at me, Hector. Yes, that was like... Among Us imposter using that guy's telephone. That was very strange. We have nearly got every single entry. He got turned into a mouse. Hello. Uh oh, why is she why is she calling me? I noticed that you've been experiencing regular disruptive calls from a false caller with ulterior motives. I've seen to it that this false caller shall no longer be a blight upon me. Keep up the good work, employee. Alright, thank you, hag. It was always someone that would call, repeat themselves. And it was always like it it was like a different name and face. Someone said, you got the phone call from Carol because it was a house fire. Uh, I think this is going to fuck up the system again now, if it's ringing like that. There's, there's some kind of insect in my house, and I, I think it may have died. Uh, I saw this big, nasty thing fly in through the window, and I haven't been able to find it anywhere, but I, I think maybe it electrocuted itself somewhere because I can smell this awful burning scent throughout the house. Can someone come find this thing and get it out of my house? What's that? ADHD autism fidget object? It's literally just a it's it's just a bottle opener I got from the Heineken Museum when I went to Amsterdam. Yeah, my system's fucked again now. Alright, so that's like a warning that your system is about to get fucked. There's an insect in my house that may have died. I saw this big nasty thing fly through the window, I haven't been able to find it anywhere. I think it electrocuted itself somewhere because I can smell burning through the house. Chat saying lamp sprite. Chat saying lamp. I mean, I I got I got nothing. I got nothing here. Chat, stop saying house fire! Stop saying it's a house fire for every answer! This is worse than the frozen pipes bit. 
Alright, I'm gonna pick lamp sprite. It might be a house fire though, think about it, think about it. it might be a house fire. Alright. Alright, what we got? It, it took my Unlucky. It took my Unlucky. No. Well, he might have frozen pipes. <laughs> he might. He might have frozen pipes. <laughs> my my child's been kidnapped. Uh, frozen pipes. It wrapped its tendrils around her and took her down with it. I saw by my own eyes. I don't know. Does the does the rose bush have tendrils? Chat is just saying housefly. Yeah, cheers, mate. Uh, where's the false rose bush again? Hang on, false rose bush. Does it have tendrils? Because it might be it might be that. Fake house fire. It, could you imagine if there was a fake house fire like on this system, and it was just a house fire where nothing happens? Floor roots. Tree-like brown roots that are known to grow upwards from the floor and wrap themselves around various objects. Floor roots slow enough that they serve very little danger to awake and aware human adults. However, if they're not spotted quickly enough, they are a known strangling hazard for human children and pets while they sleep. Removal should be priority. Okay, this one's going to be like really grim now, this this solution. I bet you the kid's fucked. Floor roots require something to wrap around before they will cease their growth. So it's advised to acquire dolls or similar human-shaped facsimile to give them a safer alternative. Place the dolls in the affected room and leave the roots alone for the night. The dolls and roots should be gone, and the room is safe to inhabit. Make sure any repairs to the floor will utilize... There's no solution for that. There's literally nothing. That's awful. Damn. Alright, I guess floor roots. House hub fire. this call. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Right, let me cook here. I think it's that, uh... I think... It's that, uh... The mirror. I think it's the mirror. I forget where it is, though. I think it's the mirror, Nymph. I'm gone. Yeah, they can't recognize their own face. Yeah, it's 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 mirror nymph. It's definitely mirror nymph. <laughs> Chat is still saying house fire for every answer. Wait, you forgot who you are? Uh, that sounds like the symptom of a house fire. Uh. <clears throat> Mirror f false frozen 
hairline fire. That is just every buzzword imaginable. I think some homeless or druggies might be in my house because I keep finding used needles, cans, metal scrap, and other such nasty things on my living room carpet. I have children in this house, and this is a very serious hazard to their health. Anything, How is she yes, going to I read the information the about the nymph with no eyes? So I assume True. that you will send over the proper authorities to deal with this matter promptly. Please oh yeah, so I made a good point. Like, how is she going to be told the information on the mirror nymph if she can't see? Uh, I think this is that trash goblin, the trash gnome, right? Keep finding needles, cans, uh. Large clumps of fur, tipped garbage cans. A hoard? Really? A hoard is an odorless collective. It's known to collect and store large quantities of refuse. Prone to spreading disease. Rotten food. Use syringes. Oh, right. It is Horde. It is Horde. Okay. Alright, let's give that a try. Teenage bedroom. I don't think that's an option. Someone said it's bed bugs. Yeah, bed bugs do use heroin needles and then leave them scattered around the house. That's a very good point, actually. That's a very good point. They alerted the horde. Yeah, just left for dead. Like, ooh. Yeah, is there some kind of home security camera I can purchase from you guys? For the last few nights, we haven't gotten any sleep thanks to some punks outside with flashlights or something. Someone keeps flashing these bright lights through our windows at night, but I haven't been able to see who's doing it. I want to catch them on camera so I can finally bust these stupid teens for all they're worth. Is there some kind of home security camera? The last few nights I haven't gotten any sleep. Thanks to punks outside with flashlights. Someone keeps flashing bright lights through our windows, but I haven't been able to see who's doing it. Please. So lights at night. Maybe a night wisp. What does a night wisp do? Is that the one that just begs you to come outside? Oh, bright floating lights. Ah, the easy clap. Yep, it's that one. It's not a house fire. It's not a house fire! His house is not on fire! He's saying lights are outside the house, not inside the house! <laughs> I like... I like I like how you were just posting the fire emoji as well. It's not... it's not a house fire. It's not a house fire. Clearly it's a house fire. Shut up. Oh, that'd be a portal, I right? Like maybe I should step through it. I think that's a portal. Yeah, I think I think I need to go inside. The wind feels so nice. Yeah, it, it said they had a draft as well. Mm -hmm. That's that that's a portal. That's a portal, surely. Surely easy clap on the portal. Uh basements or underground cellars. Uh I found some kind of door. Uh yeah, it's gotta be a portal. Yeah. Easy clap. Yeah, we're speed running through these now. Easy clap. Thank you, Adam, for the ten dealer. Been a long time fan. Uh, Shrek has swag. Wants to say you're awesome. You should watch the smile tapes. I've heard of them before. I might have watched them. Yeah, that was portal easy. It wasn't a house fire. She literally said she found a doorway. How's that got anything to do with a house fire? This might, like, 
sound strange, but I think there's some kind of like squid or something in my bathroom. No, no, squid game. Squid game. Squid game. You know, and I could see something slithering under near the sink with its like uh, little tentacle or like tendrils or you know whatever. But when I turned on the lights, nothing was there. <laughs> I checked under the towel, like under you know like that little soap thing and everything but i know it's somewhere like it's too freaking big to have gone down the drain still gotta be hiding in here bro was yapping for like oh. nine minutes shut up this might sound like strange but i like think i found like some kind of squid game uh like um um like um um um, um, um. shut up there's a squid in the bathroom. I, I think, like, the only thing I acknowledged from that was the soap. So it might be soap. I think there's some kind of squid game in my bathroom. Went into the bathroom, middle of the night, and I could see something slithering near the sink. I mean, that has tendrils. That has tendrils. When I turned the lights on, nothing was there. I checked under the towel. The little soap thing. Do they hide? Identifying soap sprites can be difficult. I think it's a soap sprite. <laughs> Chad's just saying soap fire. Please get a new bit. Get a new bit. One joke. One joke. Like 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 that there, there are there are more games in the PS5 library than you guys have jokes on rotation. 100%! We did it! I cannot wait. I cannot wait to get my coupon. My coupon? I'm so excited! I'm so excited to get my coupon. I'm so excited to get my coupon. You have no idea, guys. You have no idea how excited I am to get my coupon. Why is there someone in the background? That wasn't there before. There's someone there in the background. That wasn't there before. That wasn't there before. Okay. Oh, that is the cat! That is the cat! Look, it's got the eyes. This address is no longer active. Oh, that's the mic guy. Hello, if you're receiving this email, it's because you've been emailed by this address before. The employee this address is registered to is no longer employed here at a home safety hotline as of 1996. This address will be shut down and no longer able to send or receive email messages. If you still need support, then email us. Thank you. Yeah, he got, he got, he got tapped. He got one tapped. What is this one? The Hag Hide. Congratulations, employee. Your high accuracy rate has awarded you today's daily coupon. The Hag Hide. Sourced cruelty-free... From the perished and treated with our flower-scented formula, these are the best quality hag hides you'll find this month only. We'll even throw in an iron wall mount free of charge. Let the whispers keep your bed the safe haven it should be. Sleep easier, sleep safer. Hag, Haglin for deals. That's a bit spooky. Uh, there we got. We got another... I remember being told that we've got to work Saturday and Sunday, so I think there's two more levels left. Thunder Peak. America's most dangerous yet rewarding hiking locations. And this guide will show you how you can be best prepared for one of nature's most beautiful trails. Supplies. What are those supplies? 
As with any hiking trail, you'll want to ensure you come prepared with supplies to help you meet the demanding physical trials ahead. Four twenty nine ninety six was a Monday, so you got a full week left. Make sure to bring hiking boots. Water bottle. Iron sword. Uh, uh, hello, Dark Souls. Hello. Climbing gloves. Why iron sword? If you don't have access to all these materials, be sure to consult one of the Thunder Park guides before embarking. The trail. <laughs> I'm really trying to get immersed in this, bro. You got someone in chat saying Gemini House Fire Entertainment. The Thunder Peak is a straightforward but steep trail consisting mostly of switchbacks leading through a natural cave and finally a short climb to its pristine peak. Pace yourself as you progress. This both conserves energy and helps you appreciate the scenery around you. Damn, that is a really nice view though. There's, there's a place you can like hike in the UK called the Peak District. I've been hiking there once. It's actually amazing. It looks so nice. Be sure to stop and read the info signs littered along the trail. When you see red and yellow lines, it means you're in a high rockfall area. Travel with caution. I so guarantee while this guy's filming, there's going to be like something like like it just it just it just comes across the corner like, <laughs> and then it just hides again. Once you've entered the quiet zone, remain completely silent. As you approach the cave entrance, remove your hiking boots. Oh, you gotta be quiet now. Enter the cave. Nah, I'm good. Nah, I'm gonna do my own thing. I, I, I don't want to go in there. Nah. Someone, someone said in the chat he's taking his shoes off to avoid the fire. Please get a new bit. Please get a new bit. Please get a new bit. We're making a fire with this one. <laughs> when inside the cave, move carefully and quietly. Do not stop. It's going to be a jump scare. I think the person in the background might be the woman talking about the portal earlier. Also in before the ending turns out to be a jump scare like Iron Lung. Love you Pyro. Fair point. The woman talking about the portal. Ah, oh, the woman that talked about the portal might be the one in the background. That's actually a really good point. That is a really good point. Yo, this stream is fire. Follow the lights, do not stray. That's a really good point. That might actually be her, like, stuck on the desktop. If you hear this sound, stay still and unsheathe your sword. Why would you go in there? Why would you go in there? Are you, are you silly? Are you acoustic? Why, why would you go in there? Once you exit the cave, put on your boots and gloves for the final climb to the peak. You made it. Now enjoy the view. <laughs> Someone said in chat, um, if they died, how did they upload this to YouTube? You are an idiot. Idiot. <laughs> it's 1996! YouTube wasn't a Help thing! Me. I've been hearing strange sounds in the night.
your house in on fire. <laughs> you trash the 10. Yo, this view is fire. Kind of like, uh, kind of like a house fire, right? Ah, it's so funny. Oh my God. I hate you all deeply. Right, that's it. Yeah, I think that's her. The woman that was like, uh, she got, she got trapped. She walked through the portal and she got trapped. Saturday. I think it, I think it's only today and tomorrow. But we, we've been 100% in chat. We've been 100% in. I will begin the shift. This one, I feel, is going to be very hard. This one is going to be very, very hard. <gasps> Look at my calluses. I lift so much. Right. We've only got like five entries left, I think, that aren't accessible. You're welcome for that. Yeah, you get half half the donos on this stream. Hey, yo, the Fae don't like iron, and there are an awful lot of coupons for items that are made of iron. Just saying. It could be a Fae fire. The Fae don't like iron, and there's an awful lot of coupons for items that are made of iron. True. Hello, woman. Hark. permissions to grant thee access to all relevant household hazard information. Continue thy labors, employee. Soon thy time in the soil arriveth. Prepare thy body. What? I'm gonna go to a house and set fire to it. We got autumn vines. Bed hag. Oh! oh my god, is that Colossal? Is that Colossal's mum? Some kind of animal has gotten into my cellar. I know it's down there because I can hear it flapping around sometimes when the house is quiet. Tell me what to do to get rid of this thing because I think it's getting into all my Pinot Noirs and Chardonnays. I found a whole bunch of broken bottles on the floor. Ah, uh, it's it's the wine nymph or whatever it's called. Please hold. Bed hag. Elderly woman like appearance. Bed hags can in fact be beneficial to a home, as their presence can frighten off other pests such as various insects or mice. In the cases where a bed hag is undesirable. Use the pest removal services. I think I think it's the wine nymph or whatever it's called, right? Wine sprite. Dorcha. Is that just an old man? Dorcha is the one who delivers. Homeowners experiencing Dorcha commonly report feelings of immense dread and the sensation of being followed or pursued. They may also experience visions of a great lurking shadow. Dorcha will deliver, which it seeks. There's no coming back from deliverance. Dorcha is otherwise harmless to humans it does not seek. To be sought by Dorcha is to be found by Dorcha. If you or a loved one are sought by Dorcha, it is advised to grieve and find peace through acceptance. So it's basically like those people on, on daytime TV in the UK that like come into your house and take your TV away. Leprechaun. Small humanoids covered in long brown hair. They consume common household valuables such as jewelry, silverware. Neighbors doorway. Door frame like structures. Puka. That's just a dog! That's just a dog standing up! That's not that's not an entity, that's just a dog! What? That's just a dog. That's just a dog standing up. I I see I see the I, I see those like all over TikTok. That's just a dog. Fire o cynical. That's a dog. <laughs> Reanimation. Deceased remains of any living creatures moving on their own. Reanimation's pursuit is slow but relentless. Make peace or bargain. Spriggan. 
I remember fighting those in Skyrim. They were they were awful. Rarely seen in households, they are known to act violently upon homeowners. Troll. There he is. Twelve foot tall nocturnal creatures that are normally not seen in the home. They will deflate their bodies in order to fit into homes. So they're like they're like anti-inflation, basically. Thanks to their ability to inflate their bodies. Okay, let him cook. Let him cook. An out of control will leave by morning once it's secured its bounty. It's recommended to install UV lights to prevent future break-ins. Warlock Remnant. Residual presence left behind by former warlocks inhabiting older households, castles, or underground village dwellings. Let's do the uh, the the wine wine sprite. There we go. Average Irishman. Shadow Wizard Buddy Gang. We love casting spells. Homeowners can purge the remnant with the use of a Sealy Stone. But the journey to reach one is both long and perilous, and it's not recommended. Again, they just say, uh, how about you move house, bro? It's it's too difficult. So, uh, I, I think something may have died inside my desk. It stinks to high heavens, and something is leaking out of it. I have to lock the door to my office since my kids are overly curious about the smell, so... I need to know what to do about this as soon as possible. I think it's the wood. I think it's the wood. I was gonna say it was the desk hob, but I think it's the wood. Sometimes formed from wood that has been mistreated. They drip wooden materials, furniture, or walls, sticky, pooling, buildup. Uh, they can be deadly to humans, causing a rapid translation of flesh if ingested. Once started, they will continue indefinitely to remove. The offending wood should be replaced entirely to prevent wood from entering the secretion stage, ensure good care is taken of it, and refrain from scratching, knocking, or banging on surfaces. Do not ever insult or shout at wood. Right, let's, do, let's do wood secretion. We've got access to everything now, I think. Yep, we got access to everything on the entries. There's nothing left. I think some of the stuff on the entries are a little bit on the nose. I liked the subtlety in the opening stages. Some of it's got a little bit ridiculous now, but I still really like this game. This is a really good game. I think there's someone watching me. Outside, something is moving around in the trees, and I can never get a good look at them, but... I know they're out there. I've seen their eyes. I don't know who they are, but the police were no help. They just asked me stupid questions like Level. if I mowed my lawn recently okay, or if chat. I ate fruit in public or something. Chat. Told me to call chat. You. I don't I think that's... I don't think Howard sounds like that. Because Howard looks like the level 5 Gat Riz man. Look. Level... 5 Gat Riz, Livy... Level 5 Gat Riz, Livy Dunn rizzing up baby Gronk, Ice Spice What the Dog Doing, Skibbity Toilet in Real Life only in Ohio, We Go Jim's is Creatine Alpha Sigma Cadebor. <laughs> Level 5 Gat Riz? Level 5 Gat Riz, Livy Dunn rizzing up baby Gronk, Ice Spice What the Creatine Doing, Kaisenat Phantom Tax, I have brain aids. Put a bullet in my brain. Hollow point round. Expand my brain with the metal. Uh, someone's watching me outside. It's moving around the trees. Trees could be spriggan. What'd you say, Gabby? Oh yeah, you said you said spriggan as well. They're rarely seen. They act violently on homeowners who are provoked. How do you deal with them? They cannot be persuaded to leave home once provoked. However, we can take precaution and prevent provoking a spriggan. 
Refrain from removing trees, flowers, or weeds on your property. Do not ever kill or hunt wildlife within view of your home. Do not eat any wild fruit or vegetables that may grow on your property. Consider making offers of water each night, left in a clean dish on your porch. I'm another horror game. I wonder, since Paro is the one playing this, if this game is It's not all in the head. head. Shut up. It's not all in the head. It's too spriggan. Level 5 Gyat Riz, Livy Dunn Rizzing Up Baby Grunt, Kai Sinat Only in Ohio, Phantom Tex, I Spice Creatine, Mewing, Face Looks Maxing, Chad Riz. God, our next generation is absolutely fucked. Can you call already, you fat bastard? Thank you. My brother told me to call this number, but I don't know why. Things have never been better around here. My brother says he doesn't like the way the leaves move. The way they grow around the house like a warm embrace. Things are good here, brother. Things are good. Would you tell my brother that things are good? Sounds like you are dealing with a house fire. Sounds like you're dealing with a house fire. Right, she she's been brainwashed. Someone Someone brainwashed her. Autumn vines, autumn vines. They slowly grow over a house occurring during the fall. They report feeling dizzy, lightheaded, or blissful. They release pheromones in the air, while non-toxic and cause household accidents, thanks to their blissful dizzying effects. Locate the initial growth from inspecting the soil from an extended red parent vine. Pull this vine out and burn it. is absolutely fucked, says the guy who made MLG Teletubbies. Shut up. Alright, let's do autumn vines. Is she restarted? She might be. She might be a little bit acoustic. I'm not too sure. I, I might... Honestly, if it's not a house fire, I'm just going to go over to a house and set it on fire. Someone in chat said you should have said it was bees. <laughs> There's a bee in your house, clearly, woman. Like, why, why are you so happy? <laughs> clearly, you've got a wasp in, in there, in your house. Hi. Do you know how I got here? I'm... She's on the Zah! <laughs> <laughs> Please, I was told that you could help me. My family. They aren't my family. They aren't my family. I, I don't know what's happened. Please tell me how to get back to my family. Okay, it's not that she's forgotten her family. She thinks they aren't her family. I feel this this isn't the, the thing I picked before. I'm not sure what this could be. Neighbor's doorway. She probably just has dementia. <laughs> That's a little bit messed up, chat. Come on. Neighbor's doorway. Let's have a look. Neighbor's doorway is a door frame that can appear in basements or cellars. They are known to cause confusion if stepped through, as well as para parallelism. Autism? Neighbors' doorways do not cause any direct harm, but if stepped through, the resulting autism will often result in unwanted household activity, such as rising up Livy Dunn in Ohio, Guy Sinat. <sighs> Shut up. <sighs> Missing memories in the human who came through the other side. Neighbors' doorways are tricky to remove because they accidentally, without accidentally putting one's body through them, potentially triggering, tri 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 triggering. The parallel activity. I can't speak. I can't. Level 5 Giat Riz. Alright. We're saying neighbor's doorway. Dyslexic. Can't read. Lol. I can read, but I'm trying to read all the text on screen and then unfunny donos and then shout on top of that. It's a lot. Ha <laughs> ha 
fentanyl. <laughs> Is that Leon talks a lot in chat? Is that Leon talks a lot? Didn't didn't you do a video on? Oh, that's right. Your video on the most accurate depiction of an addict. Fuck it. Get out my recommended. I see that video every day. It was a good video, but fuck off. Didn't you do a video on a? Uh... You did a video on a. Uh... Handburger. Joshua Graham from Fallout New Vegas. That's right. That was a good video. That was a good video. Oh, you beat me to it though. Kill yourself. That was a very good video. Level 5 Giat Riz. Right. Uh, Rotten Eggs. Could this be Could this be a trash gnome? Possibly? Could this possibly be a, a trash gnome? Skibbity. The eggs are burning. Stop fucking saying it's a house fire. Stop saying it's a house fire. Alright, fair feast. The feasts are mid to large sized piles of various edible food substances, including flour, cornmeal, and various species of fungi. I saw this awful, disgusting pile of crap on my dinner table. Not dangerous if consumed. Oh, I'm sorry, I knocked my cup off my desk. I have to get this cleaned up. <laughs> what is that, Donna? Hello, what is that, Donna? Hello, this is the first stream of yours that I am watching. Shit is actually funny and I absolutely love it. I should probably go finish the other half of the Utopia video Lola from Russia. Thank you, Knowing, for the 10. Feasts are not dangerous if consumed, but if left untouched, they can provoke more dangerous activity, such as cockroaches or carpenter ants. Feasts are a sign of a hospitable presence, and such should be consumed immediately. That's just a pile of slop, bro. That's just a pile of, like, actual potato slop. It looks like a, it looks like a Bosnian meal. Look at that. Nicest meal in Georgia. Alright, fair feast. Pyro, don't make the same mistake as I did for Claire. It ain't no troll. It's a fair feast. Trust me on this. Thank you, Gabby, for the tent. Yeah, I, I picked, uh... I picked fair feast, anyway. So... Is that that? That's just George Clooney. That is just that is just George Clooney. Uh, my kids can't sleep at night. I've been spraying about fifty different kinds of pesticides all over the place, washed and scrubbed all the bed sheets as much as freaking possible. And every night it's the same story: bunch of itchy kids with nightmares, waking up at four a.m. and begging to sleep in Papa's bed. I'm fresh out of ideas. They wake up in nightmares. Please hold. They wake up with nightmares. You said it's bed bugs, but they said nightmares. My kids can't sleep. I've been spraying 50 kinds of pesticides, washed and scrubbed all the bed sheets, and every night the same story. A bunch of itchy kids with nightmares waking up at 4 in the morning. Feeding on the blood of humans. Itchiness. They don't transmit dangerous diseases, relatively harmless. Their presence can often attract other pests that use them as food sources. Ah, so it could be something else. Wouldn't you wake up... Wouldn't you wake up in nightmares if you were bitten all over? No, I'd be too busy dying in the house fire. 
Bed bugs have developed a resistance to the majority of pesticides. That that that's a nasty one. That's like I like that's... your funny words, British man. Just wanted to say that I love your channel and your content, and I look forward to your streams. Thank you, Chin Connoisseur. Don't do the eating thing. I'm I'm skipping that one. I'm skipping that one. I'm skipping that one. I'm not having you spam eating nine times, bro. My fellow Americans, I can concur that Home Safety Hotline is one of the most liminal source engine creepy feeling PS1 style 90s era games ever created. It's so backrooms. That was the most... Shut up. God damn. Buzzword heaven. Teeth hurt. Okay. We're still freezing our butts off over here. So tell me what the hell is happening right now so I can get this fixed properly. Okay, teeth hurt. Holmes he has been having issues. I feel him saying teeth hurt is giving something away. So it's cold? And the kid's teeth hurt. Someone said Darman. Frozen pipes? Okay, that's kind of funny, because it might actually be frozen pipes. It could be a house fire. Why do I keep feeding the bit? Like, I, I, I complain how unfunny it is, and then I keep feeding. Leprechaun. How is it a leprechaun? Long brown hair, consuming common household valuables, in addition to being a nuisance. Their appetite for metals can also cause long-term damage to heaters. Ah. Leprechauns can occasionally cause direct harm to humans where homeowners have metallic medical implants. Ah, such as braces, crowns, or joints. So it is a leprechaun. They need to be physically captured. All right. Let's get that fucking leprechaun out of your house. Take it outside, shoot in the back of the head. <laughs> Alright, leprechaun. Happy to be of help, Charles. Oh, is that why everyone was saying Jack Septicai? Because leprechaun, they're, they're about the same height, to be fair. Top of the morning to you, laddies! <laughs> Oh, it's this one. I think some pranksters may be giving my wife and I a run for our money. <sighs> Lately, my wife's clothes have started going missing, and at night I keep hearing this strange, whoopee cushion type sound coming from outside. <sighs> I, I tried to scare the Thank you, Rybad, right for the five gifted. Appreciate it, man. Night and putting out whoopee outside, cushion type sound from outside. <sighs> My wife's clothes have started going missing. I hear this. So someone is just going outside of his house and like farting. I tried to scare the kids off by keeping porch lights on. But I think they're onto my tricks. Is it a troll? It could be a troll. Deflate their bodies. Missing clothes. Yeah. Yeah, it's a troll. It's a troll. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm going to pick... I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to pick troll. The stealing clothes bit, and and the the whoopee cushion sound. We've got to be nearly done with today, right?
Was that a troll? Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. I get it. I said the bit when I got trolled. I get it. Shut up. Was was that a troll? Hello, I saw your commercial and I thought I would call just in case you might know what's going on. I was recently putting on my kettle for a bit of afternoon Earl Grey when I heard this awful buzzing sound coming from the cupboard. I looked around inside, but I couldn't find anything but a few loose tea leaves. I'm quite concerned about the hornets and the bees and the like because I'm, I'm quite allergic to their stings, you know. So I just wanted to know if there's anything I should be worried about right now. My hearing isn't what it used to be, after all. Shut up. You sound like you sound like vegan teacher, bro. Shut up. Go eat falafel. It might be a tea sprite. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, it's all gone again. I think it's a tea sprite. I was recently putting on a kettle. I uh, heard this buzzing sound. Chat, is it tea sprite? I think it is. I'm gonna say tea sprite. Hello. Hi, we need some medical help. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what to say since I talked to our family practitioner already, but he said to call here, so we've been um, having some trouble sleeping. I thought it was just me, but both my husband and I started feeling shortness of breath. It could be a house fire. It could be a house fire. Be like. Me. We tried washing all the things in the house, but that didn't really help much. Thankfully, the kids haven't had any issues yet, so could you help us out sooner rather than later? Could be a house fire. Could be a house fire. Please hold it. Family practitioner left. Having trouble sleeping. Started feeling shortness of breath. Worried about something spreading through our house. I don't know. Bed hag? Is it bed hag? It is all up to the gods. I think it's fixed now. It's like the normal ringing. Thanks for playing the game I recommended. Love your content. Thank you, Binding, for the 10. That sounds like music, right? That's music. So, whatever it is, it plays music. Maybe it's a gnome. Ah, oh, Whistling Fungus, maybe. Sounds in the walls. Oh yeah, because it's in the walls, isn't it? Had a hard time sleeping. Hang on. Oh, that's the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the same. That's the same. If you hear a whistling fungi singing in harmony, evacuate your home immediately. If they ever sing in harmony, do not return for any reason. What happens if they sing in harmony? Does that mean the house is going to collapse? 
Okay, I might tell her it's a house fire. Whistling fungi. There we go. The Last of Us. She already died? Yeah, probably. Um, hello? Can you help me? There's this terrible smell in my house, and I can't figure out where on earth it's coming from. I think it's upsetting my puppy Meatball, too. He's really been acting up lately. I can hardly blame him. It smells so terribly rotten. Please, can you help? <laughs> Someone in chat said the smell of fire. It's a terrible smell, and I can't figure out where it's coming from. I think it's upsetting my puppy. Please hold. Dude, it could be that dog standing on two legs. I think it's that dog that stands on two legs. There's a terrible smell in my house, and I can't figure out where it's coming from. I think it's upsetting my puppy. He's been acting strangely. Is there anything about a smell? They replaced the household pet. They're harmless. A foul signifies decay from the past corpse. Yeah, I think it's a, it's a puka. Your dog been killed, and your dog been replaced. My puppy girl is acting up. <laughs> Brap! Brap! Oh, it's this guy again. Fuck off. Stop calling my number. Go away. Little bro needs to stop calling me. 100%! Let's go! Let's go! We did it! Let's go! Let's go! How much longer is this game, by the way? Because I'm... I'm... I feel like I gotta take a break. Is, I'm assuming it's only one more day. I'm assuming it's a week. Yeah, look, she's gone now, and now there's a hole. She's gone. There's a bra there's a web browser. Seven more years. It's the last level. Yeah, I thought so. Let's have a look. We are happy to report that we are most pleased with your labors. We're currently making all the necessary preparations for your impending dissension. Assuming you pass the trial, the soil is fertile. Keep up the great work, and thanks for working through the weekend. What's 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 the coupon? What's the coupon? Congratulations, employee. Your high accuracy has awarded you the Glamour Stone. Whether you're simply too tired to concentrate, or you just want to look your best without the stress, our stones are here to put you at ease. With our patented protective seal, 99.9% .9 reliability. Wham, glam, thank you, ma'am. A glamour stone's expensive, dame. There's a web browser. That wasn't there before. Oh, this is just like... This is just access to everything. Oh, yeah, this is just like... It's basically just an archive of everything. Okay. Hang on, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna piss and then I'll be back.
I crave. I crave another iron brew. I crave another iron brew. This is great, by the way. Look at this. It's like it's it's like ice cream flavor. It's fucking good. Right. I I feel this one's going to be very different because we've already got access to the uh, the bestiary, I guess. So this one's going to be a little bit different, I think. We will see. Oh, it's already bugging out. Clock in. Thy trial hath begun. Okay. This is definitely different. We gotta lock in, boys. Alright. This might be Carol. What the hell? We are many, we are above, we are followers of our queen. What are we? Submit answer. You have to pick, like, the right answer. We are many, we are above, we are followers of our queen. Oh, that's bees, right? I'm sure that's bees. Showcase a knowledge. Oh, we're going deeper. Not the bees. It said we're above, though, and it said queen. It's not a house fire! I am not living, yet I clatter. I am small, I am weak, I serve my purpose, then I die. What am I? I am not living, yet I clatter. I'm small and weak. I don't know, I got no fucking Being idea. Hard. Oh, you can't even view anything anymore, right. Chat saying animation. Forge ahead. Oh, man, that iron brew tastes so good. What we got? What we got? That is scary. Look at that hag. Look at that. I am friend to the water of the sky. I am the beggar. I am the encroacher of the dry. I am friend of, to the water of the sky. I'm a friend to the water and the sky. Rain nymph. The, 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 the carry chat is doing today is actually godly because me doing this on my own, I'd be fucked. Rain nymph. I am dry, I'm friend to the water. The water of the sky! Oh no, it is a rain nymph. Yeah, I thought it said water and the sky. All Gabby, by the way. Yeah, true, true. Press on, employee. Let's hit this one. I am the harbinger of death. I am the bringer of pestilence. I am forever the nuisance. What am I? I am the harbinger of death. I am the bringer of pestilence. I am forever the nuisance. Nuisance makes me think it's a troll. I'm the bringer of pestilence, I'm forever the nuisance. Oh, everyone's saying fly?
It could be a fly. Wait, chat, chat, fly isn't a th an option. Oh, it's house, house. I nearly picked house fire. Oh my god, I nearly picked house fire. <laughs> Could you imagine? Could you imagine? I just do house. The game kind of fell off while we fighting the Riddler. Uh, I, th I think it's alright. I think the game's definitely gone on too long. And it hasn't changed format, but uh, I I've still enjoyed it. The concept is interesting, like working for an evil company, though. I seek the domains of those who have too much... I seek the domains of those who have too much step within and they lose their way. That's a portal, right? There has to be a portal. Step within and they lose their way. Please, <laughs> Is it a portal? Chat? Stop saying rat. Rat isn't even an option. The IRS. Closet Labyrinth. Expand thy mind. I'm sorry, I'm gonna believe what Gabby's saying over uh, anyone else. We are companions of gardens, we compel those who tread to no to tread no longer. We are companions of the gardens, we compel those who tread to tread no longer. Please hold. Companions of the garden. Maybe a seedling or a spriggan. A no seedling. Info successfully sent to client. Let go thy stilted soul. That, that's a mole. That's literally a mole. I am the dancer, I am the bringer of destruction, I consume the weak and the reckless, I am forsaken oil and the care. I am the dancer and the bringer of destruction, I consume the weak and the reckless, I am the forsaken oil. Please hold. Isn't that the tree that like ate that kid? House fire for real this time. Okay, it's not actually a house fire, is it? Is this actually a house fire? Is this one actually a house fire? I am the dancer, I am the bringer of destruction, I consume the weak, I am reckless, and the forsaken oil in the careless light. There's no way it's actually house fire. It's actually a house fire. <laughs> Okay, the bit, the bit actually paid off. I've been streaming for nearly five hours. The bit nearly, the, the bit actually paid off. I can't, I can't believe it was actually house fire. Yeah, what we got? Dude, look at his teeth. I am the seeker. I am the one who delivers. Please hold. I am the seeker. I am the one who delivers. That's so vague. I am the seeker. I am the one who delivers. Amazon. Yeah, it could be Amazon. I could be Dorcha, right? I just remember Dorcha being like 
the one who delivers, and then you're fucked. Uh, I think it is Dorcha. That's not the only one I actually worked out on my own. Dorcha. I hope that one doesn't fuck me. I'm pretty sure that one's Dorcha, though. Are we done? The one who de delivers the house fires. Oh, look at her eyes. Supervisor Carol here. We've been watching you closely. For all this time, you have been providing excellent and accurate answers to our callers. These acts will not go unrewarded. We did it, boys. Nice. Stand by while I prepare thy promotion. Nice. Promotion in progress. Please stand by. What is happening? What is happening? Is she is she is she rizzing me? What's happening? Where's my promotion? My camera's out of focus. Where's my where's my where's my promotion? God damn, look at her thighs, holy shit. Riz. The Riz King. The bad ending? I don't think so. I definitely don't think so. We did it. Junior Supervisor. We did it, boys. What is going on? What? What is going on? The... the Bro about to get crucified. I still don't understand who that guy was that kept calling. Who, who was that guy that kept calling? The one with like the deformed face? There definitely are other endings, but I'm not playing through that whole game again to get those endings. I'll just look them up, look them up online. Oh damn! I got I, I completed the game with a hundred percent accuracy. A hundred percent accuracy. That's that's good. Dude, only 6% of people have that achievement. Get fucked. Right. So now, uh... I don't think we've got any more mail. Nah, we didn't, we didn't get any more mail. Uh, but we do have the art book. What's the art book? I'm Nick, creator of the Home Safety Hotline. If you're reading this, hopefully it means you've invested enough in this game to be curious about the development. Uh, You're thank you. welcome for the carry, Pyro less than three. Thank you, Gabby, for the actual unironic hard carry. Ah, they literally said that the inspiration was Gemini and local. Yeah, okay, that, that makes sense. That, that actually makes a lot of sense. Dude, look at that guy slurping the wine. I respect it. Read through the art book. That that was an achievement, by the way. That was an achievement to read through the art book. Right, uh, chat, I'm going to end stream because I've been going for like four and a half hours. Uh, I'm going to stream again tomorrow, probably. There, there should be a video out on Pyro Live in like the next couple hours or so. But yeah, 